brightness for Gakko. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to another Mukbang with James and Mark. If this is your first time here on our channel, please hit that subscribe button and answer these three questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? My name is James and this is Mark and we film Mukbangs every Monday and Friday, 6 p.m. Pacific time. Welcome back to another episode. Yeah. And uh, as Mark had already alluded, what did you even say? Because it just caught me so off guard. Uh, <laughs> every time we were about to go live, I'm like, okay, do you have something that you're gonna say at the beginning? And so I just never know what's gonna come out of his mouth. So it's actually a, a big treat for me because usually I know everything it's else that's gonna go on. Yeah. The beauty of live uh, video, yes. So we're super excited to be hanging out with you guys all here today. Um, we're gonna get you uh, all settled in first. I have to do some stuff over here on Twitch. So I'll say hi to people. You want to say then, hi to and people? Could take over. Yeah. yeah. So Emerita, one of our uh, early birds. It's so good to see you here with a lot of hearts. Hi, Joy. She thought this was gonna be an upload. Oh yeah. Yeah. But we're live, so you have to be committed to us for the next two hours and thirty minutes. <laughs> Uh, Julie S, um, making Mondays a little bit more bearable. Awesome. We want to give you a bear hug as well. We have Angelina with the eye emojis. I ever, ever since Angelina used those eye emojis, I've been like using it wherever I can. It's like my favorite emoji now. Oh, those look like her eyes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have Karen in the house. Welcome, Kevy Do. Welcome. I'm just loving highlighting comments. That's like my new thing right mm. now. Salvi, oof. We got Kara Jade, welcome. Hello, Elda, happy Monday to you as well. Linz, oh yes, and Karen reminded us it is the first of the month. I totally forgot, it is February already. Oh my gosh, yeah. I, I was insane. signing some things at work still January, but then good thing for me is then I just do the slash and then two before it. Oh yes, yeah. so you, <laughs> you still have like a wait, unless yeah. you go all the way to the left or whatever thing you're writing on, but it seems like you don't do that. Uh, we got Josie in the house, hi Josie. Arts by Sarah says, happy February. Happy February as well. Hi, Candice. Welcome. Let's see. We got Noah in the house. Hi, Noah. And go with the flow says, fuga. Do you know how to say fuga? That's what I tried to say earlier. Oh, I wasn't. I was, was like, fuga, go. Oh, yeah. I wasn't listening to it because uh, I was just shocked. At, I didn't even know what the rest of what you said was. <laughs> Uh, we got Desiree. Thank you guys all for joining us. And yeah, drop in the chat what you're having for dinner today. We got Tea Beavers. Happy Monday, everybody. It is snowing quite a bit on the East Coast. I've been seeing people's Instagrams. I, yeah, it looks beautiful, but also like it would be a pain in the butt at the same time. Yeah. Well, hopefully you guys are all staying safe out there. Safe, warm, dry. Yeah, all, all the good stuff. Yeah. And Bear the Berry says it's snowy here in... New York, did I say, see that right? Uh, we got Teddy, we got Dory. Thank you guys all for being here. If we miss any of your guys' comments, you know the drill, just drop it again in the chat. We got Judy and Wanda. It's good to see you guys. Yes, happy Monday. Hi, Resh Girl. Hi, Julie. Hi, Mikey. Oh, Belinda. Welcome, Belinda. Oh, Belinda. It's been oh. a hot minute. I know you've been busy, so we understand. And it was also Justin Timberlake's birthday this week, and Belinda's a huge fan of Justin Timberlake. So we should do that TikTok soon too. Oh no. It's funny how like some of these songs are getting new like life because people are deciding to make dances out of it. Like I don't remember how I, I know how I danced to Sexy Back back in the day, but it was definitely not like okay. drinks in the club and then like twerk, like I didn't do any of that. I did a lot of hip movements in that song. You still do a lot of hip movements. I know, I need to, I need to learn what the newer dance moves are. Yeah. I don't think they use hips anymore. Well, like, yeah, uh, the Britney thing that we just did, wasn't there some hips in that? Go, that's considered, like, newer dance moves? I don't know. Well, no, like, TikTok dances are, like, new dances, oh. I guess, right? But then, can you imagine doing those dances at a club? I don't think I can imagine myself doing that. Oh, <laughs> uh, Dwayne, welcome. Thank you guys all for being here. RK RKS Gamer, hi. Brenda says, happy Monday. I've been wanting to try to make chicken pho. Well, is this your first time making it? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. 
Thank you guys all for being here. Sean says, yes, pho tonight. I love pho. Yeah, you know what? Sean seems like he was paid by like the Global Pho Association. Because ever since we've met Sean, I love pho my whole life. But he took it to another place where it's like, you can door dash pho and eat it. And ever since we met him, we've door dashed pho more than we've ever. I mean, I know this year's different too. But like just getting to go pho was never like a thing. Why do you look confused? No, clarify, Sean, clarify. Sean does love pho, but I don't know if it's, I like, we, what? It made me like pho more than oh. before I met him. I don't know. I feel like we ate it, we're eating it the same frequency as all since I've, since we've been together. I don't know. I disagree. Oh, but there's nothing really to agree or disagree about. Okay. Well, because I think we just don't ever I think, eat it at I home. Think, I, I think that's why, because of COVID, eating at home, feels different for you. Mm, it does feel different. Yeah. Well, the, the new hack is make sure you heat up the broth when you get home. Yeah. Like Mark cannot stand a uh, lukewarm broth. There's no. That's not the way to eat it. So we try to like either cook it on the stove top a little bit more or microwave it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. And Belinda is having taquitos with chorizo and potato mashed inside topped with lettuce, salsa, and goat cheese. Oh my Ooh. God. That sounds amazing. Thanks you know, for sharing. I don't know why, but that is, reminds me of the really good flautas at that one Mexican restaurant next to Work Square. Did we ever eat in there? We Did had, we get to we go had for go, And we also had food oh. there too. What's the cross streets? Uh, Nicole's uh, bridal, no, wedding. Oh. Paper whatever it's called yeah yeah was there in the wedding place. rehearsal right? yeah yeah i don't remember that place but yeah i know what you're oh, talking about but their, their flautas are good. really good yeah. i only remember tequila then <laughs> did we even eat we did eat we did. yeah we did yeah. eat okay yeah. uh kayla says much love thank you for being here we're gonna we're getting through the comments want to just make sure we acknowledge as many people as you can tori d welcome happy monday k Mu says i almost stopped by to grab pho on the way home dang it you know what k Mu has been our like food whisperer. He'll eat something at like three o'clock and then we end up doing it for mukbang and then he thinks we stole his yeah. idea. Well, and sometimes Brenda ends up eating the same dinner as us too. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Avril says, Eli says hi and really waving at the screen. Let's wave back at Eli. Hi. He had, we had pho last week. His mom, my daughter makes the best pho I ever oh. had in an Instapot. Ooh, well, that's a lot of pressure. You, you could help us. Yeah, guide us. guide us. We got Stray Cat. Hi, Stray Cat. How do you make pho noodles and the soup fast? You will find out very shortly where you have it. Uh, well, you, if you saw the thumbnail, there's a big thing in the thumbnail. <laughs> well, here's the thing. Uh, even without using a pressure cooker, chicken pho takes way less time to cook than beef pho. Mm. Like, if, like, oh, yeah, because of the bones and all yeah. that, right? Yeah. So... With that and using a pressure cooker, it's even quicker, I guess. So we are trying to squeeze in pho for pretty much from scratch. Nothing's been pre-made. No. Uh, with all within our live stream. So I think this we could is do it. ambitious. I think we could do uh, it. I have all the confidence in the world in you. T B versus I've never had pho. Somehow we need to change that. Let us know how we can change that. Uh, Julie says, I always felt pho was just fancy ramen. Now that just depends because Julie, if you're using the context of ramen, because when I grew up, I, when I heard ramen, I always thought of instant noodles, uh -huh. not knowing that there was like, Good like ramen, fancy yeah. ramen, yeah, right? Yeah. So I can see where you might have that impression. It's more like herbal. It's more, um, I don't know. It's, it tastes different from ramen for sure. Yes. Yeah. Is it your preferred soup? after a heavy night of drinking huh. or hangover food like I what would you rather say get? like pho only because like in my mind i'm thinking the broth has a lot of the nutrients from the bones mm. and that's like i need my body needs to that. revive yeah i don't know i, I get that then, but it might not have to do with anything about that yeah and then we got reens over on twitch says hi welcome and Sean agrees, yes, you have to bring the broth to a boil again once you get home. It also helps to microwave the noodles and meats a little while the birth, a while the birth boils to And soften. at that point, might as well just make your own pho at home. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's a yeah. lot easier to still order. Yeah. 
What's up, Mer Mukbang Mermaid? He says, hello, my friends. Did you hear there was a massive fight today at the fish restaurant? One fish got battered. <laughs> did, not, did not see that coming, but... <laughs> well, we hope that fish is going to, going to recover pretty soon. Yes. That's fine. And Brandon. Hi, Brandon. Just had fun last week, too. It is fun weather around, uh, at least in SoCal, right? So Yeah, I think it's, it's kind of warmer, but not too warm. So it's still good weather for fun. Yeah. And we got Emily. I hope everyone is doing well during this time. Reminder for James and Mark. You guys are amazing. Much love. And hi, chat. Thank you so much. Yes, and I've been seeing it in the chat. If you guys have not yet, hit that like button. If we hit our like goal, which is set at 50, the first level, we will open up the wall of wonder and there's some uh, good and bad things that may happen there. Yeah. Dwayne's wife says, hi, James and Mark. She says, you're both so adorable. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Do you like how we both posed right after that? Uh, oh, Julie S says, the best part of pho is adding in the herbs, sprouts, and chilies. Yes, which we have a lot. In front of us. Yeah. When I was reading that comment, all I could think of was the Folgers tune. The best part of pho is adding in the herbs, sprouts, and chilies. <laughs> right? That that's when you know that they did a lot of good work on their marketing. Cause it just when people say the best part of blank, you're automatically gonna go back to yeah, that's Folgers. And I I hope that person, that composer is getting royalty and payment. <laughs> Not and for the remixes. Huh? For the remixes too? I don't know. I just hope that he's like set for life because he yeah. deserves it. Sure. All right. Well, it looks like we hit our first uh, like goal. So oh, why don't we just get that squared away? Because I always forget how to get that set up every week. So let's see if I remember. That looks right. And uh, let's see. Oh, I, we need help. Yeah, we do need help. Let's, I'll let you pick somebody. T you know Beavers. What? All right, T Beavers. So that maybe this inspires you to order pho soon. Yes. So T Beavers, just drop a number in the chat, one through nine. They're all available. We got a lot of the things that you guys know. There's a couple of things that we didn't get to last week that are still out there. So just let us know and then we will unveil the number. Uh, Triple M's, welcome. Hello, everybody. Fuzz, yummy. Mark and James, happy Monday, y'all. Just stopping by, showing some love. Thank you so much. I know you're busy, busy getting your channel up and running again. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, the number we is got four. four. So the viewers have to say to the window. Yes. Okay, until I see that lyrics on the chat room, if everyone could all in unison say to the window. <laughs> I realized that there might be some delay and you have to type it out. So I'm going to. I haven't, I haven't seen it yet. I don't see it yet. I don't see it yet. Oh, to Mikey, the window, to the window, to, to the, the wall. wall. We probably need to change it up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, okay. What was the number again? Four, 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 four. four yeah. All right. Oh! <laughs> I'm going to say this happened last week. The very first one. Yes, it was. Happened. They're all going to be so mad. I don't even want to click back to the window and see the oh. chat. No, again, we said this is a good first one. Yeah, because it gets it out of the it way. Of the Everyone way. is like, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Josie, I think that encapsulates what everyone else is probably thinking. Dot, 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 dot. That's upsetting. You know what? Just do more likes and then we can get, hypothetically, we can get through all of the if all of the walls yeah, we get, get a, a lot, lot of likes, likes right? then so will. it's totally possible. Sorry about that. <laughs> T Beavers says it's my fault. Sorry guys. No, it's not your fault. And I feel very badly. I feel like the nothing happens is now the like take a shot to make everyone feel better. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, let's, it's okay. It'll let's, get better from here. We, let's start prepping. Yes. So what do we got to do so first? So the first thing first is we're going to broil our aromatic vegetables. Mm. So we have some onions here. And again, we made pho before, but not chicken pho. So right. This is the first time I was making chicken pho, but it seems like a lot of the initial steps is the same thing what we did with um, beef pho. Like, mm -hmm. you know, and we have some um, ginger. Ginger. Now, what's the point of 
kind of uh, roasting these vegetables first? I think it really brings out the flavors in the broth. Whereas if you just add it straight up, it might be too harsh. So it kind of like brings out the aromatics, I think, by roasting it. Mmm, it smells quite fragrant. We also got our first super chat of the evening nice. from Hannah. Oh. Thank you, Hannah. Hi, James and Mark. How are you? What do you have to drink? I finally added a picture to Discord. And what do you prefer, jajangmyeon or champong? Mm. All right, first part of the question, how are you? Excellent. Happy Monday. Yes. What do you have to drink? So we're going to just drink beer today, and we have a little bit of chummy on hand. Yeah, right? we have we have a bottle of chummy in the freezer, and we have uh, cloud beer, and I, that's what we're drinking today. Yeah. And then as oh, far as uh, chang, jajangmyeon or champong, I would say I, I can answer first because you look like you need time. Overall, I prefer jajangmyeon. However, there are days, like maybe today when it's a little colder, where I'd be like champong, champong, right? But today I'm feeling like, in general, I'm more of jajangmyeon. You know, now I'm, I, I just did a quick review of my whole life mm. and counted all the times I had jajangmyeon and all the times I had champong at restaurants. I want to say 80% is what? Jajangmyeon. Yeah, 80% of my life. But I do love jampong too. Yeah. But I also like jaz. I feel like jampong, like, I'm like, well, I could just make shinamyeon. It kind of gives me a similar, like, whatever. Oh, but I guess with jajangmyeon, you could do that with jampogate these days. I don't know. I don't, why don't I choose jajangmyeon? Hmm. Yeah. And if you guys are like, what the heck is jajangmyeon or jampong? Just copy and paste those and type in James and Mark in the YouTube search. And we got videos on both of those. So Hannah, thank you again for the super chat. And I just got reminded that I need to change the like goal. Bloop. Okay. Well, Wait, turn off? that's what I, yeah, I just saw a beeping noise and then I, but I didn't see anything. Were you preheating oh, it? Oh, okay. Now, here's a little um, kind of cool. We actually have like specific pho or Asian noodle bowls. Mm. But we bought this for Vietnamese noodle dish, huh? I yeah. did it for bom ryu. Bom ryu. Yeah. So we're like, how perfect. Now we have dedicated bowls for pho. We don't have get to, to get use, use it today, too. Or should we use our glass bowls for people? No, we'll no this. this. They can, they'll see it for the most part. It's fine. It's pretty, huh? I think it's very ornate and pretty. Yeah, it's so Asia. Yeah. We got Redland on Twitch saying, my two favorite streamers, good day to you two. Thanks for supporting us on Twitch. And Reens is, it's their first time watching on Twitch as well. Claymore says, I like topoki. Yeah, that's, that's solid. <laughs> My favorite is champong, Josie says. I'm assuming that says champong, but I love jajangmyeon as an everyday guilty pleasure. How'd you know that's a champong? I, I context, context, oh. you know. Uh, Lou, sorry to hear that. We had to push back the wedding again. We're both sad. You know what? Like, it's just been a hard time to get married in general. Like I feel very grateful that we were able to get married when we did, because I can only imagine the amount of stress that newly engaged couples are going through yeah. right now. Oh yeah. It's just not as easy as it was before. Do you know any online shops to get the cute bowls like that? Oh, that's a good question. We never buy, oh, well we, we actually buy a lot yeah, of stuff. Yeah, we buy a lot of Yeah, <laughs> but these bowls we just got at our local supermarket. Vietnamese so. market, yeah. yeah. So right, what so are we adding to now here? Now we're going to toast our uh, spices now. Mm, why don't you show up close and see if people can guess what they are? What do you, what do you think this is? Or try, oh, Maybe the plate the whole time, maybe? Like, what are well, the... I mean, I don't want to tip it over, but... Yeah, I'll do it. Okay. Can you guys see that? So drop in the chat what spices you think are here. And Mark will tell you guys as he adds it. What do you think this, do you know what this is? It smells like licorice. This one right here? Yeah. Oh, you can't see it through nothing. <laughs> it's fine. Do you know what this one is? Those look like peppercorns. Peppercorn, I don't even know. Do peppercorns go in here? I don't remember what I did yeah. last time. 
Okay, so everyone's dropping in. Uh, some people said Star Anise. Yes, because that one's kind of the... I feel like that and the other one is obvious. The cinnamon stick? Yeah, so we got that. Star Anise, cinnamon. Is there coriander in here? Yeah. Is that the other... That's the whiter peppercorn looking. Thing. Got it. Okay, so we got four things. And most of you guys have gotten it. Good job on that. Sean says bird seeds. <laughs> Yeah, so star anise, coriander, cinnamon, and black peppercorn. And black peppercorn, yeah. yeah. Hi, Tara. Welcome to the live stream. Claymore says, I need new Asian soup spoons at my house because the ones that they have, the small stainless steel ones, can barely pick up any soup. Oh. Yeah. You yeah we, the... we also need to get new ones too, huh? We just have those orange. Don't We don't have the white ones anymore? Oh, I don't know. Oh, we'll see. I don't, yeah, know. I don't know. We'll check. Yeah. Kind of sounds very like I don't know. We're at a temple stay, and someone is like I don't know doing that. I don't know why they would do that, but it and then also gives me like that vibe. wood, like um, oh no, that's not gonna sound. You know the wood, uh, like drumming sound. Like, oh yeah, like, like it sounds like a woodpecker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I told Mark a while back, like I'd love to stay um, somewhere where it's like a, a temple stay almost. Yeah. That'd be fun. Though. Just kind of like relax. And... They make, they will wake up early in the morning. Yeah. They feed you. You do a lot of self care activities. Mm -hmm. What is star anise and coriander? I guess if you had to explain the flavors, could someone else help? <laughs> I know. Where, I know what they are when you taste what them. What seed but... is coriander from? Is it is it's a seed from a plant? I don't. I don't oh yeah, I don't know. Plant. Yeah, you're right. Lou says, if I have a boy, I'll name him both after you. <laughs> YouTubers. You can do Mark first. I mean, if you have a no, name boy. it together. What's your name, James Mark? No, 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 no. Just one name or the other. It's fine. Uh, someone, oh, let's see. Redland says, I love pho. Are you going to toast the onions and ginger? Yeah, so I think you oh, may have joined after the stream, but we already have those going in the oven. And this is actually a good cue for Mark to go over there and check on it. That's looking so fancy. Thank you so much. One more like everyone and we hit the wall. Yes, get us there. Nicole says, coming back for the replay, just came to like, I've been struggling a lot, but uh, I love coming back to your guys' lives. Aww. Nicole, thank you so much for supporting us. I know sometimes it's not the best time to like watch us live, but we really, really appreciate when people take the time to come back and even watch our replay. Well, that's a good suggestion. Uh, James and Mark, you should start an Amazon page, make some money and allow us to buy all the stuff you guys love on Amazon. So we only put like the stuff that you guys see in the mukbang in the description of our videos, but we don't have like another page, page for that. Yeah. And it looks like we're at our next like goal. So we Yay. will get that squared away in a moment. I just want to be uh, cognizant of what's, what's going on next. So we got onion and ginger in the oven roasting. Mark just toasted a combination of spices that are all classic spices in your pho. And it looks like he's just removing this. So are we, we don't need this? Wow. That's, that's it. it. That well, that's was, nice. That was the quickest usage of our stove portable grill. That's great. Okay. Now, what do you think this is? Um, oh my God. Just toasting this makes it smell like pho, right? You gave me it away as soon as you said that. Then I realized what it was because I did not know what it was. Do you guys know what this is? When you when you grabbed it, I was like, what is that? And then as soon as you grabbed this, I was like, oh. So if you guys haven't guessed yet. Oh. oh. How did that happen? Do you need help? Oh, thank you. Okay. <gasps> it smells like pho. I know. It smells like pho already. I feel like you can make a candle out of this. No? Pho candle? Yeah. Yeah, so this... <laughs> That's what I thought, Bear the Barrier. I thought it was a dryer sheet too. But actually it's a little satchel that you could put all of the um, herbs, mm -hmm. spices, and then that way you don't have to like spoon it out into in, out of the pho broth. Because how tedious would it be to like grab out all the coriander? Because I'm sure coriander is great in the broth, like flavoring, but not yeah. as like a whole piece. So this yeah. allows all of that to get steeped into the soup. 
and there's a flap in here that you have to kind of use to then kind of close it. Oh, so it doesn't like fall a pillow. Out. It's like a pillowcase, yeah. John, can you confirm where did you buy that from? Are you talking about this? This tea Because that's the only thing I. <laughs> that's the only thing. <laughs> yeah. <I> mean, <laughs> do people even do that? Let's be real. That just seems more like a gag, and I, and I don't. I, mean, I know like gag is like the wrong word to use, but what if does uh, anyone what, actually do that? What if, what if your guy like smells like this? Would you like it? So you saying you want me to rub some of that <laughs> for later? Actually, that might hurt. So the star anise down there, that might like prick some things. Uh, okay, we're getting confirmation. Coriander is a cilantro seed. They're usually a oh. pale tinted beige white. Got it. Thanks for that heads up. Well, if John was asking about the tea bag, um, you could get it at a Korean market. This is the big size head right here. It means big. So they have different sizes, mm. big, medium, small, but this is the big size. Mm -hmm. But the reason why there's anchovy and garlic and stuff in here is because a lot of Korean stock uses this to make um, oh, that makes to sense. make stock, right? So yeah. They can use it with fun too. Hopefully that answered your question if that's what you asked. <laughs> no cardamom pods. I don't think there is any cardamom in our recipe today. You definitely can get anything on Amazon. And yes, um, Mark was the one, Island Candies, that told me that uh, Dustin Diamond passed away today. Oh, yeah. It was really sad. So this pot here is actually the pot to the Ninja Foodie. So Mark's bringing it closer to us. Um, let's see. Hi, Amanda. Welcome to the live stream. And we have Heather. Heather, I hope you're feeling better. Oh, yeah. I feel better. Uh, we do have Amazon Prime at this at this day and age for the amount of uh, – if we did not have Amazon Prime for the amount of boxes and packages that we got here, that we have here, it just wouldn't make any sense. Uh, Bitta Mercenary says, I've never watched this channel. Welcome. Since you're new to our stream, answer these three questions in the chat if you'd like. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? Oh, should this be on the wall? Shut up, Ish Jaws. <laughs> and Redland, oh. since you're on Twitch, why don't we let uh, Redland pick our next number? Yes. Because we have to do that in a moment. Like so let me figure this out again. <laughs> It's new every time, I swear. All right, Redland, if you can uh, drop in the chat a number between one through nine, except for four. And Redland has picked number three. Nice, yeah. one of our favorite numbers. Ready? Oh, yes. <laughs> okay. Oh, just, oh okay. Okay, okay, Julie, Julie, okay. To the window, to the wall. Dance, Dance party. Okay, so this one's new. What? So let me stop sharing this. What are, so what are, ex explain it. Okay, yeah. so we, you guys know that catchy song that we have at the beginning of our mukbangs? I found uh, that clip and we can actually play it without worrying about copyright. So we thought, why don't we just add that as a clip and then in the back, we just have to dance. The full length of the song is two and a half minutes, but like how long should we actually dance? A minute. A minute, okay, like as, as we get grooving into it. Might be okay. So I need to pull up the song and we encourage you guys, if not, you're at home. Not, not watch, but dance with us. Yes, dance with us. I think that's a great idea. You know what, I'm gonna grab let me make sure I'm not off camera. I think the this is the perfect use of said strobe light, just for funsies. You know, it's kind of hard to see, but people are like, I like that song. Yeah, I, that's why we picked the song. And Amy and Bobby, that is the right attitude 
they're saying, okay, let's dance. All right, so I have to pull up the song to see if it'll play loud from my computer. Is that how we're gonna do this? Oh, I can find it on. Are we doing it from the chair or standing up? Standing up. Okay. Like, so just go around there. So you have Wait. Words at an angle. Okay, I'll tell you in a second, but I need to test the song first. So you guys, I'm gonna play like 10 seconds of it. Can you just confirm that you can hear it? Tell, tell me if you can hear the music. Are we turking? We can. Mark's stretching. Can you guys hear it? All right, they can hear it. Okay, so are you ready? You're in frame, Mark, so you're you're fine. Where are you standing, Ben? I'll, I'll find a spot. You know me. I'll find a way to get to the front. Okay, ready? Oh, my God. I haven't danced in forever. It looks like it. <laughs> get low. It's so, like, disco-y. It is. Okay, let's slowly move on up. It makes you want to do that dance move. The jiggly toe yeah, the <laughs> dance move. Ooh, I'm tired. Well, we're working up an appetite at this point, Ooh. so. All right. Ooh. That was fun. Oh, we need our beer. Yeah. Let's, let's crack our beer. Okay, well, I'm going to change the light goal. So if you guys want to see more antics like that, this is what they look like at the club. Bear the barrier, partially true, also partially not. And you know, I don't mind that the disco lights are on behind us, actually. Maybe we'll just keep them on for now. Okay, a little bit out of breath. <laughs> now, Heather asked, this is an inside joke. Uh, James, was that skanking? Do you know what skanking is? <laughs> I think so. Do you know what ska music is? Yeah. So it has to do with that. That's all I discerned from that conversation. One of my favorite ska band is um, Safe Ferris. Oh, okay. They have a song called Common Eileen, which is a remake of the original Common Eileen. Oh, okay. Because I was like, they sang that song? That's like from a movie. <laughs> uh, okay. How, how far am I pouring? Just. As much. Yeah. Now who, okay, honestly, who danced? Let's know in chat. Don't worry, we're not gonna take down names of the people who didn't dance, but you know, like, we want this to be like a, a mutual thing. You know what we should do one day is have the song on and call people in and, and everyone dance there. from their like chair. Cheers, guys. Are we the next Ellen DeGeneres? <laughs> no, I don't wanna be the next Ellen DeGeneres. This makes me want to go to the club with y'all. You know what? We are fun at the club. It's so good. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh. You think it's because we're like from, from the dancing? dancing? Probably. That was 45 seconds, by the way. <laughs> that was like more than a minute. I was like, I'm getting out of breath. We need to add the push-ups and all of the other stuff back into the the chat or the, the wall. I shimmied in my chair. Yes, bear the barrier. We love that. Emerita says, I dance sitting down. Everything move. Me too. Me too. Awesome. I had a drink. That's great. I tap my legs. Yes. All right. So we got everyone's like participating. So Joy says, skanking is moshing kind of. Oh, okay. Yes. That's what I remember from that conversation. There we go. Amy and Bobby, we are not familiar with squirrel nut zippers, but if our friend Heather is around, she may know of it or her husband. Yes, go with the flow said, I got up and danced. I danced and all my fur babies came up to me. 
Good. Everyone's dancing. Good. Every. How many of you would have not danced if we didn't have that? So thank you. Who 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 picked that number again? Redlands. Yes. Thank you for picking that number. Oh. So we also have the cook cam set up over here. So later on, when Mark moves over there and gets everything ready for the fall broth. You guys will actually get to see that. The Ninja Foodie is actually really large. We forgot how big it was. Ours is big. So we had to set up a whole other operation over here. <laughs> <laughs> so what kind of um, what kind of chicken did you get? Mm, today we're going to use just a lot of drumsticks. Because, drumsticks. Um, it was already packaged really nicely like this. And... It's only a dollar twenty nine a pound. Oh, that's very so. Affordable. All this so one two. Oh, I don't know, like nine or ten legs here. Only five bucks. Gosh, so such a great deal. And we like dark meats. Mm, and yeah. I think because we're not because like I usually like the chicken sliced already in my pho, but we're not going to do that. We're just going to eat it from the leg. Very very rustic. Very uh, rustic. Yeah, love that. Beatrice says, I dance sitting down. TVL says, NPRR. NPRR. This is a random side note. So TVL just reminded me of this. We're not going to give any spoilers away, but we watched Drag Race. Oh, yeah. And one of the songs on the show was a song that we danced to at our wedding. And so for some reason, I was on YouTube the other day. And like all of a sudden, they started getting a not like a bunch, but more views than it usually does. And it was because everyone was looking up that song that I say Mark popularized back in 2018. No one caught wind of it. All of a sudden, 2021, it's on RuPaul's Drag Race. And now it's a sudden, it's, a, it's an anthem. It's one of my favorite 90s songs. Yeah. It's a really good song. It's very catchy. When I saw it on the show, I was like, ooh. You do you really, think we did you, better? You really like when she's like, you know. I'm no, my favorite. Can I show you my favorite movie? Can you guess what my favorite move is? I, I rewatched it like two times. The RuPaul one? Yeah. No. There's a part where she goes like. Oh. Uh, like, I don't know. She's like spinning. Go backwards. Go back, spin backwards. Like this? Backwards. Other way. Yeah. Back in the middle. Yeah. And around again. Yeah, I yeah, love yeah. That. <laughs> and she's wearing her big like ostrich um, feathers. I'm like, everything about that is like what I want to embody. <laughs> it looks like I have sparkles emanating. You know what? That's the good vibes that we want to put out into the universe today. Brenda says, I will always prefer chicken on the bone. Yes. Ooh, awesome. Amy and Bobby are fans of Drag Race. We're not caught up yet, so no spoilers, please. We are using pho noodles, Island Candies. But we actually had, I don't think we even showed the noodles, so we didn't get quite there yet. Ooh. Oh, okay, now we have some uh, charboiled ginger and onion. It's, this smells really good. Do you smell it? Oh, don't leave it like that. It's scary. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I, so the onion, it like started to um, separate from it being so compact. Yeah, so here's the ginger. Yeah. And then. Like it's it's opening. You mean like it's opening up? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, thank you so much, Beatrice. I love you guys so much, and I don't miss either of your lives. I make it every Monday and Friday. Oh, thank you. And Redbone, thank you so much. Your lives truly make my night. We're so happy to be <laughs> there for you guys and entertain where we can. Chicken titties are $1.99 a pound. You know what? Chicken, white meat tends to be more, it is ex more expensive than dark meat, huh? Why is that? Is it because of demand? I don't know, actually. Because Is there more meat-ish? Kind of, but yeah, we, we're like a dark meat household over here. Oh no, Regan says, I recently got rid of my cable and the only thing I miss is track race, so... <laughs> Tammy, we are doing well. I hope you're doing well this evening as well. Hi, Tammy. Oh, and TVL says it's because it's healthier, the white meat. So therefore they can upcharge it. Yeah, that I think sense? that the, like people are like, oh, white meat's healthy, so they want it, you know? Yeah. Uh, that's not too early to ask, Elda. It might be, uh, what are you guys planning on doing for your birthdays? I don't know. Maybe something virtual?
Yeah, I haven't, I haven't given much thought to it. It's not like it's a milestone year either, but then it's like we kind of skipped over last year. Last year, so it's like I don't want to go two years in a row where we don't do anything. Um, we do have plans for our anniversary, which I don't know if I've mentioned on the channel yet or not, but either case, we're going to probably film a small portion of it. So hopefully you guys can look forward to that. It's going to be exciting. It's totally something different for us. Do you have to squeeze in one more smaller drumstick? Is smaller. there anything else left? That's it? Just the water? Yeah. yeah. Let's do that. Get in there. Oh, and we got another super chat, this time from Joy, the $10 super chat. I've been on the computer for work all day and finally took a break to come watch you and drink. Oh. So Joy, let me ask you this question. I know you can't answer like in person right now, you can answer in the chat. When do you not drink when you watch us? I'm just wondering. Thank you so much. Yeah, what are you drinking tonight? When are we busting up the tummy later? Mm -hmm. You don't know. I mean, how about after you get this set up and we can take one for Joy? And then Hannah. And Hannah Joy, as well, yeah. For Joy and Hannah, like, we could do it. We could share a shot. Yeah. But for now, we're going to drink our beer. Okay. So this is our roasted spices in our tea bag. Mm. So just stick that in there. Um, let's see. Some rock sugar. And rock sugar, what's the difference between rock sugar and any other sugar? I don't know. I was so curious about that, too. Yeah. I, don't I don't know either. Oh, I need more water. Oh, Joy's having Dr. Pepper and Jameson. Can't say I've had that combo before. Have you, Mark? No, but that sounds delish. I actually want to try Dr. Pepper and red wine. Is that a thing too? Or something. I heard Coke and red wine. Coke and red wine, is it? Yeah, some Have soda any? and red wine. Mm. I'm curious to try. And Redline asks, I have a couple questions for Mark. What's One, that? have you ever considered opening a restaurant? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that good. You know what? We're still not even up to the max line. I'm just going to do living room. Might water. as well, right? Might as well, yeah. yeah. Okay, question two is Have you ever created your own noodle dish? Like, like just any old noodle dish? I don't think so. However, he made something so good yesterday. I'm so glad we filmed it because um, we weren't gonna. And then we ended up doing it and it was so good. You guys will probably see that video uh, in a week. And then Mark is Korean. Unless you ask what kind of noodle dish, in which case, neither. Oh, Mikey says, I switched it up. I'm drinking, I'm drinking not your father's root beer. Ooh. Oh, you put that straight in? Oh. For chicken pot? That's what I saw. Oh. It looks beautiful, huh, guys? Okay, now Mark is adding. This was what again? Cilantro? Yeah. Okay, and now he's adding some fish sauce. Right, I guess we did tell everyone that we're doing a yurt thing. <laughs> I remember. James doesn't really remember much yeah. of Friday. Let's just say that. It was fun, though. Yeah, we got the party lights on because we were just dancing probably right before you came on stream. Ooh, hi, Dan and Irene. We heated up those cookie plug cookies last night. So oh. good. Well, glad you guys are enjoying them. Those are really good cookies. Yeah. Okay, I think. Are we ready? Am I missing anything? So let's see. We added our chicken, our aromatic vegetables, our spices. I did some um, fish sauce and sugar mm -hmm. and, a little, and a couple pinches of salt. But the thing with this is you could always flavor it after it's done cooking yeah. too. Yeah. yeah. And then John asks, is that like a ceramic pot? So this is the <laughs> pot for the inside of the Ninja Foodie, which I'm going to add to the stream now. Go ahead, Mark. We're going to do the close-up one. 
Okay, we're still at the max line, so that's okay. So we're in still we're still in good condition. Oh, this is not the wrong. Okay, the, the reason why this is big is because we have two lids for this. One's, oh. one's an air fryer lid, and this one is a pressure cooker. Lid. Got it. Got it. Got it. And congrats, Dwayne. He's lost 125 pounds. Oh, nice. That's amazing. Well, this fall recipe, if you're up for it, it's pretty healthy. You could definitely give it a try. Brenna asked, did you add the love? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna blow my nose into this. <laughs> I don't say happy Monday to you as well. What are you making for dinner? And Renz, this is like a Instapot and air fryer in one. How come I can't close this lid? Hold on. There's like a probably a certain way. Yeah. That's not registering. Right. Maybe it's because I'm seeing it from the back side. Oh, it could be that. Make sure I don't knock the camera over. <laughs> yeah, yeah. John is encouraging you and saying, come on, Mark. Oh, that looks. I got it. I didn't know what it was. Because I was on the back side. Yeah. I couldn't tell. But yeah. it's okay. Right, turn on the camera. Okay. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Okay. You got to give Mark some credit. He never struggles on our channel. That was probably the most struggle I've ever seen to date. So. <laughs> How much are you uh, adding in terms of time? I'm gonna start with 20 minutes. 20 minutes. And then is there a temperature setting? High. It's just high. For pressure cooker. Got it. Oh, make sure you close your uh, vents. Yes, that's super close important. Make sure it stays closed and then start. Okay. I think we've done such a good job at promoting the Ninja Foodie and yet they've not reached out to us yet. <laughs> they just have not. All right, we will go back to this business. And then uh, should I get the, oh yes. Should I go get the- More please. I forget how many quarts this pot how do, is. How do you say ajama? I think it has to be at least- Six? Four? Six. At least six, it's either six or eight, but- it doesn't say it anywhere very visibly, huh? Who knows? More, how do you say ajama in Vietnamese? Um, bye, bye, I guess, but I don't think you would say that. That's or how do you say auntie? Go. I'm at a restaurant. Would you say go, yeah, go, go? go. Um, Mung ye, eh? Heineken, please. <laughs> oh, uh, so it, it's in the freezer. Oh, oh yeah. James takes forever just to get like he gets he gets so distracted, but then you got up to get the chummy. And then I'm like, I'm here. <laughs> I wanted more beer too. Oh yeah, we have some more beer. Are we doing Somek for this one? Wait, shot and then beer. Oh, that's beer, I remember. <laughs> we had yeah. a lot of beer with John before. Speaking kind of, of kind he's of the one shirt. that said, beer is beer. Yeah. <laughs> oh, remember that? Was it Mikey Chen that we watched where they st yeah. stabbed I'm, it into I'm, the cat? That's scary to do that. I, I want to try it, but I'm kind of afraid to do it. Yeah. yeah, I wouldn't recommend it. So why don't we do one I don't know. Just do whatever. We'll Let's do it. one shot, and then the second shot, we'll drink it with so much. Yeah. And then that would be for the two super trusts that we got. Oh. <laughs> Ready? Yep. Yes. <laughs> Ooh. Mm -hmm. Not bad. It's good. It's good today, Ooh. actually. Hmm. Now, what do we do for this whole time? Do we have appetizer? Oh, 
Chinese don't we have Chinese donut because James wanted to add Oh to yeah. Bar. I'll do that. Wait, so is the 20 gonna just be for the it's gonna be done or do we have to no, add more? It well it it's not it's oh, not too much. <laughs> it's not twenty even though we set the time for 20 minutes, it takes time to build up pressure. So it might be like 30, 35 minutes mm. total. Okay. So then but I'll do it. It's 20 minutes. It's the the time uh starts once it builds pressure okay so from right now to that happens is that doesn't count towards the point got it got it got it we still need to cook the noodles too so that's why we have some time mm -hmm. but did you want to snack on something we have the yeah. dried fish we have... oh dried fish sounds good yeah let's do that okay. yeah this is a good question is there an alcohol that you like james that mark doesn't like I would probably suggest tequila more than he would, but it's not that I like tequila. That's probably the only one where I might have like a little bit more, like I'll drink it and you're a little bit more resistant to it because you probably have had more negative experiences with it. But then sadly, like I usually be like, mm, okay. <laughs> like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. For like sure. I'll like be like, mm, okay. Well, yeah. What actually that's, I don't even know. What would you rank your low, like your lowest, like, alcohol that you don't enjoy as much i mean don't get me wrong i do like tequila especially the nice tequila i just know that sometimes i drink too much of it yeah know? i don't know like hmm, don't look at our is. bar because everything is here for a reason. oh like malibu shots oh or, yeah well, um, can't do that or anymore. or parrot bay shots like i can't too sweet mm -hmm. So in, if the liquor is sweet, then I need to add vodka to it to kind of down it down a little bit in the yeah. sweetness. And John's theory is I think Mark drinks everything, though. I mean, you ain't wrong. I mean, it's, He won't it's, say no to a drink. If it's in front of me, then yeah. And a couple of people have already said to the window, so let me oh, get right. that squared away while Mark... Yeah, let, let me get that squared away, and then we'll uh, get back to this. Okay. We have time, right? And I think we're I really... getting to our light goals really fast. I love it. What numbers that we've only done two numbers so far? Yeah, four and three. Yeah, four and three. Yeah, and then we need to pick someone to let's choose Harold Hurwitz. Since you just joined the stream, you get to choose a number from this window that we're about to share with you. So, welcome to the live stream. Yeah. Choose any number except for three and four. And we're going to just hang out. Mark's going to get uh, this fish going in a moment. Welcome, Shaquavia. And Jessica Lane Realtor says, hi, guys. I've been missing you. Thank you so much for hanging out. It's all good. Times are busy, times are rough. And Lindy B, welcome Lindy B. Hi everyone. Do we have a number yet? I think we're waiting on a number. Let's let's give uh, let's give him another minute before we move on. And I asked Harold for the number. Harold, where you at? Where, where you, you at? at? Where you at? Where you at? Where's my where my girls at? Front to back. Oh yeah, so, so when that? I when I do the share screen, it it shows the other camera by default unless I remove it, but it's fine. It's okay. I mean, yeah. status update with yeah. the ninja foodie, you know. <laughs> make sure it's fine over there. <laughs> <laughs> we just need to make sure that it's still on. Yeah, yeah it's still building up pressure. I yeah. mean, this is good. Now we know that it's on, you know. Yeah. We could choose a number four, Harold, if um all right, I'll know. let you choose because you I know where things are. Eight. Eight. Don't be late. Eight. To the window. To the wall. <laughs> Why did you grab yourself? Oh my gosh, no. My body has a response to that now. You're oh fine. Gosh. You're fine. You're fine. All right. So Chipple's punishment. I guess I will get that squared away in a moment. Way to go, Mark. <laughs> Gosh, I regret choosing that number. 
Bond's life. We're going to send you positive vibes. She says, hi, boys. Perfect timing. I'm having a terrible day, and it was getting worse by the second. You guys are the perfect distraction. You know what? Use us as a distraction. Please, we're yeah, fine with that. Please use us. We are fine with that. Julie says, Mark's reaction. I know. <laughs> so if you guys are curious, this is uh, dried. So this is actually this is monkfish. So uh, we usually get chipo, but this is agupo. Agupo. Oh, agupo. no. I'm wearing like a light colored shirt. So Mark is just heating it lightly, heating lightly it, over yeah. the flame. So we'll do the chipples right after um, Mark finishes. It's, it's dangerous to do the chipples in this at the same time. Like he might, we might warm it up. So that's good for us, you know. Yeah. Keep them likes coming. Thank you guys so much for supporting us. If you guys are new to our stream and have not yet subscribed, consider hitting that subscribe button. Answer these two questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? Please subscribe. And I want to say we haven't showed our silent viewers love in a little while. So oh. if you're a silent viewer, drop your favorite emoji in the chat just so that we know you're there. We won't. We might just highlight your comment and move on. That's it. But we love everybody that decides to participate in the chat and those of you who like to watch us silently i hear a lot of people like to watch us when they're cooking or doing chores which yeah, is great which is totally fine yeah yeah oh good night lou thanks for dropping by not good feeling night. super well yes we hope you feel better soon yeah. julie is doing her psa warning remove your headphones for chipples I mean, that's really sound and great advice. You know, Julie, the more I've gotten to know Julie, she is one of those people that she's it's a, always nice to just hear what her advice is. She's a sound of yeah. reason. Yeah. Always a sound of reason. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, it smells very fishy in here. Like, yes. Jess, we're happy to hear that. She says, uh, hi, thanks for making eating easier. Of course. Yes, Renz, this is fish. This is perfect with um, beer and like just drinking and chilling. And then Mark has the scissors. I'm going to get a fresh bottle, I guess, for the chipples. Or We're not going to use, use. Yeah, we can. We can use. Yeah, well, you can just use that then. It's, it's, it's we, just literally just, came out of the freezer. Yeah, we just took it out of the freezer. Yeah. <laughs> Beatrice says, I love when James does a siren. Don't egg me on, girl, because if you say that, I'm going to just do it, like, randomly. But I'm not going to do that yet. If I drink enough, I will. Hi, Christina, Christina. Oh, wait, I'm not allowed to acknowledge the people that. But let me let me highlight. We got quite a bit of emojis. This is your guys' moment right here. Let's let's do this. Bloop. Bloop. This is, like, a loving kind of bloop, by the way. Not a bad bloop. And these, these emojis truly... Feel like they are from our silent viewers because I haven't seen the names in today's chat. So thank you guys so much for showing us yes. love. Thank you. Yeah, Shell, exactly. Anju. Mm -hmm. Ajima. Uh, Hana, Anju, Chuseo. <laughs> Wei. Uh, Maha says, hi, guys. Hi. Welcome, 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 welcome. Love, 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 love seeing everybody in the chat. The chat is like my favorite part. I just have to say thank you, James, for keeping up with the chat because I try really hard to keep it, but I can't really read it that well. And the chat goes by so fast. Beesh, so James, look at everything you're doing. There is no way you're doing. It's a two person operation. One job is not more important than the other. No. That's the only way we've survived thus far. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Want some mayo? Oh my god. I was just gonna highlight this comment. Oh, you gonna dip that oh, in mayo? Oh Brenda, Brenda knows what's up. Yeah, we're gonna dip it in mayo. A thousand percent. Had Brenda not said that, I'm glad Mark would have said it because I would have been devastated if we didn't dip it in mayo. You gotta dip this in mayo. Ooh, I'm salivating right now. Yeah, so it still says for some reason it went from 1080p to 144p. Check it on yours. Maybe that will solve the issue. I know that sometimes YouTube by default puts it on the lowest resolution. So sometimes you have to actually manually go in and change it to the highest. Plus, we're hopefully getting our internet upgraded by Wednesday-ish. So, but luckily it doesn't look like there's too many um, connection issues tonight. 
Siobhan says, hi guys, love watching y'all. Love you too, thank you so much for the support. Shaquavia, are you reading my mind? What's up? Can you guys do dim sum breakfast mukbang live soon? Girl, are you hacking into our computer? So Wednesday, I did, I did not have enough time. I apologize. I did not have enough time to do a preview. Oh, what, what's that before I get into it? We added some uh, furikake, furikake. with our mayo. Just yes. to add color to little the mayo. A little color, a little bit more fun. But our Wednesday upload, 4 p.m. Pacific time, is a dim sum car mukbang. Our next video is going to so, be it. So perfect timing. Yeah. Enjoy that. We... Yeah, we haven't done it live yet, but okay. So it's like, yeah, it's like, oh more. shoot! You let me go first because <laughs> oh my god, my shirt's lifting. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> <My God>. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> Did I even get it? Yes, but you were so aggressive. Am I? Then you should let me go a uh, second. You like? Oh, wait, I did go second. <laughs> oh it's God. because you get so much. Oh, how is it possible? Is is it possible that when you do it, this this one is like, oh, I feel cold too, but nothing actually happened to it, like in solidarity. <laughs> Anyways, I. That happened so fast. It was kind of like you were talking to me, and you just decided to give me a shot, and I was like, what's happening? I felt like it went through my body. That's how much force you <laughs> added it to my, to my head. Yeah, everyone's like, no warning. I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> it was probably better that way. Oh my God, I have to do this for the rest of the stream. <laughs> I'm, I'm, wearing, I'm wearing black today. Oh my, you can't really, yeah, that's fine. Each of you is going to have one icicle nipple and the other normal, yeah. That's a good question, and we probably should consider it. Do you alternate nipples? We probably should. We should just, but I think we just go for the closer one. Hmm. How about between the legs when wearing shorts? So, like, we're gonna call them chais, like thighs, but with chummy or chickles. <laughs> What's that? Chummy dick. Ew! <laughs> Why is it touching that? Mmm. <laughs> Shaquavi, it would be... Oh my gosh, Shaquavi, watch your video and you will relate. I'm just going to highlight your comment. No spoilers, but read, read Shaquavi's comment before I take it down. Yay, thanks so much. I go to HMart to look for something and I just don't know the names of them. That's all. Oh wait, is she referencing dim sum? Because it reminded me of what you said about dim sum in our video. Oh, is that's that? A, oh, is that? That's what I thought. Maybe I, I didn't hear it right. And yes, a lot of mentions in the chat about Discord. If you guys don't know what Discord is, it's basically like an online community where when we're not live, we can hang out with you guys. We've been playing games. We've been seeing all the delicious food that everyone from across the world has been eating. You can post it on there. You can listen to music. You can chat with other subs. It's a it's a fun place. So if you guys can. Consider. Simply put, simply put, it's like a Facebook, but just for our community. Mm -hmm. No strangers, no other people, just people who watch us. Social media platform, kind of. I would, that's the best way I would describe it. And let's say hi to Cooper. What's up, Cooper? What's up? Julie suggests the name could be Dipples. Dipples. <laughs> There's a lot of good names for it. Do you mind if I turn on the air? Yeah, go for it. You know, dancing, and then you know how I've been like checking in the broiling like onion and ginger. Mm -hmm. Being in front of that just made me so hot. Island Candies, we saw you on the chat or in the Discord, so it looks like you're on there. And Josie said, "Yeah, I saw your post." How's the anju? How's how's this uh, dried monkfish? It's good. It's pretty good, huh? Do you like this one better or the um like because the, the original one is cheap pole, the cut up. I think it's cuttlefish. I don't. Both know. of them are good. This like someone said, it, it's like fish jerky. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
What's up, Vanessa? Thanks for dropping by. Oh my God, that's a that's a tree. Elda says, oh, sorry, click the wrong one. Elda says, guess what, guys? No more working until 9 p.m. Until Oh, so that means like future streams because she was always working until 9. Oh, I thought, I thought like she has to, she gets the break until she has to start again at I'm 9, like, you're right? starting her day at 9 p.m.? Oh, yeah. You must be tired. Oh, I yeah. see it. Um, I see. No more working until 9 p.m. Yeah. Forward. Yeah. Oh, that's good. No more, no more hours. No yeah. More hours. And happy birthday, Cooper. Happy birthday. I like the name Cooper. Yeah. Uh, there was a sh sitcom show in the 90s called Hanging Out with Mr. Cooper. I don't think it was hanging out. It was hanging with Mr. Cooper, right? Don't Isn't that the same, duh? No. Hanging out or hanging with? It's different. Hanging out with Mr. Cooper. I don't remember. Oh, is it, are you okay? Oh no, it's just. Oh, I don't know why my arms are sore. It's, it's no, like, you haven't been lifting me baby, lately. Baby. You think that is why? Yeah, because you were like hyper extending for those parts. Follow us on TikTok, James and Mark. One word. <laughs> so we are making fa. It's in the. Mm. Throw the camera for a sec. Oh, what's this mean? It's, it's, still, it's still building up pressure. It's building up pressure. Oh, it reminds me. Do you guys remember those old mobile phones that had Snake? Oh, yeah. They should do that. Josie says, you guys have a TikTok? Oh, my God, Josie. Find us. We just did that. Brittany, like, do, 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 do. We had fun. It was fun. I realize you probably haven't seen it because we only posted it on TikTok and Instagram. Yeah, it is um, that Nokia phone had it. The TI-85 calculators had it. Mm. Now, were you good at the snake game? Which one? There's more than one. You're so innocent sometimes. I, I don't know what the snake game, what's the other reference? I'll show you later. <laughs> <laughs> Why, ew! You said that so creepily. That's... I'll show you later. <laughs> um, I think I was pretty good at it. But like, how would like I? How would you know if you're good or not? Is a you, you don't play, you play against yourself. I just know I'm good at games. <laughs> I'm confident in games. That's all you know. You won Catan once, and Brenda won once uh, yesterday. Yeah. And I won on Saturday. <laughs> hi, Vanessa. Can you, can you say hi to Vanessa? Can you say hi? So now I, you can see my text. We see your yeah, chat. Yeah, we see you. Sure. We see you. We see you. We're live. Redland asked earlier. I don't think I um, addressed this. I wonder how that dried fish would be with sweet teriyaki. doesn't really need it, but it could work. It's, it's not sweet. Overly sweet, but kind of sweet. But this one is spicy too, so it's sweet and spicy already. So the mayo is a really great um, dipping sauce because yeah. because this is already flavorful. Yeah, yeah. You know, life during COVID um, hasn't been as bad. We've been very fortunate, and we have plenty of videos where you can go back in time and see our thought process throughout this entire past 10, 11 months. And we really have all of you to thank for um, to keeping us kind of happy mm, as yeah. much as we can during COVID, really. <laughs> Hannah asks, what was your first phone that you had and what was the carrier? Mine was, um, what was before single or Pac Bell? I think it was Pac Bell. You had a Pac Bell phone. Oh, interesting. That, that was the carrier, Pac Bell. Pac Bell became singular. Singular became 
AT&T, I believe. Mm. And yes, go check out Angelina's channel when you guys can. Yeah. Anna just recently subscribed, and I also bought your daughter's channel. Yes. Quality content there. Also follow her on Instagram. Angelina's Instagram gets me through my like uh, her Instagram like sleepless nights. And my <laughs> YouTube channel really good. Oh my god, I was gonna grab the beer to drink it. WTF, Sean says, what is Pac Bell in singular? He didn't even, is that even how you, you spell that singular? You didn't even spell singular correctly. Uh, that's how old, that's how young Sean is. Yeah. <laughs> Julie says, I was social distancing before it was popular. So Julie's yeah, actually so trendy. Yeah. You're such a trendy person. And La Lakeisha says, hi, James and Mark. Bye. And it's Teddy. Welcome to the live stream. Yes, please subscribe just like Jeremiah or Cooper has done. We really appreciate it. And then answer these qu three questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? Yeah. Oh my God. I can hear it. It's going to, it's going to. Oh, should, up soon. should we even, let's just switch over real quick so that you all can see. Can you see a little bit of the steam? I'm, I'm, I'm pointing my, the cursor like you guys can see it, but right above. The, the handle. Can you guys see that? That's what it's all. Ooh, I can start smelling it. Already? Don't you smell it? Mm. Okay, so make sure you don't put your head over there to like smell it or it's not worth it. Just, you know, you can kind of hang out. Unless you want to open up your pores for deep cleaning. Yeah. No, don't, don't do that. Don't do that <laughs> either. Yeah. So it's building up steam and then, then the seal covers it. Mm -hmm. And then it's going to cook for 20 minutes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, now I can definitely. See. Is the vent closed? It should be. I checked two times. Let me check. This is considered closed. Oh, oh. oh, it just closed. Yeah, it just closed. Oh, you took the I, camera away. That would have been a fun. I didn't know that was going to happen, but. I knew it was going to happen soon. Yeah. I can tell, yeah. Okay, so 20 minutes from now, the broth should be done. Yeah. Remember MCI? That sounds familiar. Yeah, there's a that, that's not a cell phone company. It was a phone company, like landline phone. Oh, we had MCI growing up, but they went bankrupt too. I don't. I, don't, I totally don't remember. MCI. Who was your landline carrier back then? Do you remember? Was AT and T your own? I think so. I know my. I know for sure my aunt had Pac Bell because that was the red logo, right? It was red. A lot of companies change their logos throughout the year, yeah, so it's so like even really hard to keep yeah. up. Yeah. I think my first phone was one of those ones where the antenna breaks really easily, and it, you, you flipped it. And I broke the phone twice. It was silver, I think. Your cell phone? Yeah. I didn't have a phone. Like, probably when I first met you, it was, like, my first phone. Oh. I didn't have a phone until I was, like, 20-something. I didn't have it when I was a teenager or anything. Yeah. All right. It looks like we have to get back to the wheel or the wall. Already. And we should play a game every time I call it a wheel, something bad happens. Uh, okay, wait. So let's let's pick someone else to uh, choose a number. You know, Elda, let's choose you because you shared some good news with us. So we want to give you a chance to share good news with us. So let me share our screen so you can even see what numbers are available. And we could also look at the uh, Ninja Foodie. Yes, there it is. <laughs> I don't like that. They should not do that automatically, but I guess you can't help it. Are people talking about their ringtones? Because Kemu Young just randomly said Destiny's Child Bugaboo. Is that is ring that tone? your is that your ringtone? I could see that. Uh, Redland says most of the food items you have or mentioned I've never seen before. I live up here in South Dakota, not much of variety or Asian markets. I live in a small town, a population of 1,500. The nearest Asian food is two hours away. Wow. 1,500 I'm, I'm population. I'm curious what the nearest Asian food is. Do you think it's uh, sushi or Chinese food? Chinese food, probably, Chinese? yeah. Probably Chinese. Because isn't South Dakota landlocked? Mm -hmm. Oh, I mean, I have, they could still have sushi, but. All right, Elda chose number seven, I think. Let me Lucky go. seven. Lucky seven. Let's see what. Let's see what happens. You guys tell us first. 
To the wind, I saw it already. Okay. To the window, to the wall. I don't remember what seven was. I don't know. Unlock oh. dessert. Okay. All right. Okay. We have a couple of options. All right. A I couple do, options. I can do that. Yeah. So there's a ninja foodie again. So does it now that it's on this stage? Is there a timer for it? Yeah. Oh, okay. And that was based off of what you initially pushed. Yeah, the twenty. But looking at the cam, it hasn't hit yet. So I, I think it's still building up pressure Ooh. before. It, yeah. All right, guys, you guys are doing good momentum. It's only been an hour and fifteen. We've already done four light goals. That's nice. that's pretty good. Nice, pretty good. Nice, nice, nice. Unlock dessert is my fave. I have no idea what we even have for dessert. Me neither. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the noodles shouldn't take long at all. No. So the only other things that we have to do is the noodles and the Chinese donut. Mark, did you ever have a blackberry? I did. How about a razor? No, I never had a razor. I had a blackberry pearl. Um. So this is the noodles I got. Bánh phở tươi. It means so, fresh pho noodles. Yeah, fresh. Um, so if this is not dried. Mm -hmm. So when you cook it in the um, in the boiling water, only for five to ten seconds. Mm. And you drain Super it. Quick. Yeah, and then then you put your soup and stuff in it. So mm. this shouldn't take long at all. So I'm not even gonna put it in the pot now. Yeah. There's not a lot of time. Left. That's a great point. I forgot about this detail. Remember free weekends and after 9 p.m. And then uh, mobile to mobile was really popular too. Yeah. So I think T-Mobile might have been like one of the first ones or sing I don't know. And I'm like, do you have T-Mobile? And they're like, yeah, it's like, great. We could talk at 2 p.m. Mine was like, don't call me until after nine. Yeah. Like I remember how, telling friends, like I'm Can not gonna you imagine be there they charge for every text back That's then. That's crazy. That is crazy. Yeah. But back then, even with free text over like at nighttime, no one really texted a lot. No. It was always phone calls. And wasn't texting the old school way where you have to press the number three times yeah. to scroll? Oh my yeah. god, no. Oh my gosh. And then yeah. now people don't like to be on the phone, they just like to text. Yeah, and then now you don't even have the text. You just say voice command, and it's like. <laughs> and then by next year, we're going to implant microchips in our brain, and we don't even need to have phones. We could just communicate through our brains. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Candace had the pink razor. Forgot it was spelled like that. I forgot it was spelled like that, too. Oh, yeah. Who made razors? Motorola. Motorola. And Renz had the BlackBerry QWERTY phone once before. Hmm. Yeah, the BlackBerry was really cool when it came out because um, that's when I was beginning to like work, like I call it on a work. I was like, oh my God, like my work email on here. And then like it was really easy to type a lot of text. And then mine had a little pearl that was. Oh, like I remember ball. the pearl. Yeah. Yeah, so that's kind of cool. Is there two options to release the Steam or no? I am telling you, guys, are you doing a quick or manual release? Well, you just. And it goes. So the difference is uh, mm. for quick release, what that means is once the 20 minute time, like once you hear it go off, you immediately then just undo the seal to release the steam. Mm. For natural release, you just wait a few minutes for that. See that red uh, blocker? Yeah. For that to naturally go down. And then you release it. It still steams oh, a, lot. a lot, but uh, you're just letting that red thing go down first, and then you release it. But down. normally you do the first way, is what I've remembered. I kind of wait until the thing goes oh, down. Okay. I do. Because I feel like if I don't, then the steam's going to be even more powerful and dangerous. You know? Yeah. Sean says, I loved my pink razor in middle school. I thought I was Paris Hilton. Thought. I think you still think you're her. Where's where is uh pepper in a purse in a Louis Vuitton purse? Oh, didn't you buy a nice purse recently? Was that to put pepper in? Oh, 
love how everyone's just going down the, <laughs> the rabbit hole of what form of technology they had first. This is great. Oh, and Julie said or asked if it displays the time on the um, Ninja Foodie, which I think I can yeah. add it real quick so you guys can see. Yeah, here's the countdown. I feel like we're on an episode of 24 right now. Mm. What do you have to do to diffuse this pressure cooker? Drink more? Drink more or it'll go off now? Great. We drank, but the time is still going on. You have to diffuse it. Don't worry. I, I got I got things in check today. Don't give me that look. Everybody thinking it, and now I'm saying it. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Don't worry. We've been eating a little bit. No, James is fine. I'm worse when I drink on live, so... Oh, you don't have to go there. <laughs> no, I feel like I deal way more embarrassing things than you, so <laughs> totally okay. John says, I really miss 24. Didn't it come back for like a short, like that was very popular when things were popular to bring back as a short series. Who's, I thought they brought who's 24. the actor again? Uh, what's his name? Uh, I don't know. Steve. Ke Kiefer Sutherland, I think. Oh wow! Yeah, it's so weird. I was gonna say Jack Bauer, but that's his name in the show. So weird that you're really good at knowing names, but then when you ask me, "Oh, who made Razor?" I'm like, "More like like." It just depends. It names? depends. Well, that guy was in Designated Survivor, no? Right. So I was gonna say the reason why I asked for his name is because I don't think he could get any role, other type of roles, because in Designated Survivor, is it reminds me of Twenty Four. Because mm. did you like, actually watch Twenty Four? Because I never did. Really. I saw like maybe. The first two seasons. Wow. Yeah. My brother was really into it. And this is when he moved back home um, between college and grad or med school. So then when he was watching, I was like, I guess I'll watch him. Yeah. Oh, let's read Beeper Lingo right here. Can you read that? I love you. you. Miss, Miss you. you. Is for uh, Y? Mm -hmm. What's O O then? Just O. -E. Oh, but the. Maybe Island Candy spelled you as Y O O, oh. but then oh, like Miss Yo, <laughs> Miss Yo, like Miss Yo, my calculus teacher in high school. Ooh, you miss her? You no, her, her name is Miss Yo. You did one four three one. Oh seven, my god! Seven, no, 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 four, no, no, no. Oh, oh. Okay, I knew who I was in high school. You were still going through it. I knew. I knew when I was like five. I know, but you still like like girls and. Ask them to dance in high school because you like them, and they're like, yeah, oh. like their company. But there was never anything beyond that. There was no to become one situation. <laughs> <laughs> um, girl, Elda's going back. She said, "Who remember buying vinyls or eight tracks? Not us. No, my those were <laughs> my first music was uh was cassette tapes." Yeah, but I was fascinated by vinyls because I would only see it when I visited my aunt or grandma's house. Not aging you, Elda, but they would have that. And then the 8-track, too. That was I thought they were... It looked cooler than a cassette to me because it just looked so much more... The way it was presented just looked I don't know, yeah, cause, more fun. Like, I'm sure cassette tape was like, oh, people are like, oh, this is so cool. But then doesn't it all be because it's not portable. You can't oh, carry yeah. a big yeah. black round disc around you but cassette tape you put in your pocket so maybe that's yeah. why it was more popular yeah. oh and ocean streams just joined and gave us 200 cheers thank you so much and we got a super chat at the same time oh, oh james thank you guys so much you guys came in for the one two punch all right so oh, i feel oh, like oh. we should drink to this oh, i'm good with another oh. shot because I feel like it's keeping things interesting. People are like, is one more shot going to take him over the edge? <laughs> what are 33s? Is that before vinyls? I'm sorry. I don't know what 33s are. Well, the old school music player was called something phones. Um, the ooh, you you crank it up. Oh, um, 
not homophones. And then it has this yeah, really that elaborate big horn thing. Like, yeah, speaker horn. Phonograph? Phonograph. Is that what it's called? What are those called, guys? It looks like a cornucopia attached to like a, a box. Yeah. 33s are vinyls. Oh, I did not know that. You know, uh, as a kid it, from my elementary school, like some of the educational videos we saw were on laser discs. Oh my god, laser discs. But what's that like, technology did not make it that far. But aren't laser discs essentially CDs, but big, they were bigger? Like yeah, it, but yeah. it didn't really catch on. Wait, like. what's the one that didn't catch on? Was it Blu-ray or the other one? There was two competing types of mediums, Blu-ray and what's the other one? No, called? it was um DVD or Blu-ray, right? Oh, no, 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 Blu-ray. You're right. There's two there's two like versions they had a dvd player yeah. and a something else player no was it blu DVD or was it blu-ray oh blu-ray or hd dvd hd dvd maybe hd dvd you just blu -ray or hd dvd let someone else confirm because we don't know i've already made a fool of myself by calling it homophones earlier <laughs> <laughs> that, what's an example of a homophone then uh words that sound the same well, no, what's an example? Like here fire. and here. Ooh, you knew it. There and there. Ooh, we should make that a game one week where we have to keep going until you can't name a home phone. Why do your eyes get so big? <laughs> You're buff today. Huh? You're looking like a snack. <laughs> Don't touch my P on my NPR. You prefer me to touch another P? <laughs> Thought so. Wait, we're supposed to drink this. Oh, shoot. Cheers. Thank you, Ocean Streams and yes, Jane Doe. Ocean Streams and Jane Doe. Oh. Okay, oh, Bonnie said phonograph, but then as I was taking a shot, the corner of my eye read pornograph. I was like, what? <laughs> but phonograph, oh, maybe that was it. I want to make french fries on one of our streams. How do we make that work? We've done that before, no? Like, where we mm, and batter it. Oh, I thought you meant like frozen french fries. Oh, no, fryer. like for real Z fries. Oh my God, the, the Blu ray versus HD DVD really bothers me now. I want to say it's a, something. <clears throat> what do I even Google? Blu ray rival? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, while Mark is looking that up, let's. let's Take a peek, see. We got 10 minutes to go. Oh, I was right. What is it? Blu-ray and HD DVD. You thought I was joking. It's like Marshall I, putting random letters. I don't know about joking. I just thought you were wrong. There's a difference. That's all. HD DVD. Congratulations. Which, the winner in my opinion, challenge. like when, it, when those two <laughs> technology advanced from DVD, I'm going to be honest. HD DVD made more sense to me because they're like oh it's dvd but it's hd now you know blu-ray is like huh so even though now i'm thinking back blu-ray is a cooler name than h like uh it's like i don't know two similar things but one has a better name mm. you know? yeah. we, I, I, I never got of, into that, like a so. brand name or a generic brand like if you see the packaging like oh, yeah. they might be the same product Oh like yeah, Blu-ray looks all cool and hip, and then it, and the other one is just generic branding HD DVD. You know, yeah, like, yeah, boring. I That's like how I feel about cereals. Do that a lot in the father's oh. music. It's like we don't have the real Frosted Flakes, we have the Happy Belly. But Frosted Flakes. these days, um, There's generic similar. brands are upping their brand look. Like it's minimalist, it's simple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Nick, I've never heard anyone compare us to Nico and Orlin. So there you go. I've never heard that comparison. Ever. Well, here here's some similarities. Uh, they're a same sex couple. Mm -hmm. We're a same sex couple. They're on YouTube. We're on YouTube. They don't do mukbangs. We do mukbangs. Yeah. So uh, there's a lot of. He there's wears some, red, I wear blue. There's some intersectionality. Intersectionalities. I didn't even know that was a word. <laughs> Is I, that like where you meet? Like, I, I use that all the time. Can't you say commonalities? 
intersectionality is just, I feel like I would say that wrong. And then people be like, what did you just say? Like, I just, I said it and I just said, what did I just say? I'll add that to my vocabulary. This one over here, this one over here, really good. And Jackie says, hi from Atlanta, Illinois. There's an Atlanta in Illinois, or is this, or is this like one of those like tricks? Or is there, uh, there's Springfield everywhere. Do you think there's a uh, Chicago, Georgia? <laughs> <laughs> Someone look that up. I will die if that's is true. Is there Chicago in Georgia? Oh that's my gosh. funny. That yeah. is so funny. If you guys are new to our stream and have not yet subscribed, we will eventually eat, but hit that subscribe button, stick around. We're having fun tonight. And if it is your first time here, answer these three questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? And please subscribe. We're trying yeah. to grow our subscription number and only you could really help us get there. Yeah, now the, the conversation, I feel like we need to do like a retro night because everybody be, everybody be pulling out there like all the tricks in the bag. Now the talk is about LimeWire and Napster. I don't think I understood LimeWire. Which is like Napster. Yeah. Don't recall. Oh, we got another super chat. Love and miss you both. I'll text you later on my homophone, so keep an eye out, betches. You know, we haven't seen Sean in a while. I, do, no, I know. I do miss you. We're sorry we could not um, make it the other night. The other well, night, but we can. We normally would have, but we literally had like something to do, which like, is rare. Which is rare, but like, yeah, we ha we had something to do that night. But we'll figure we'll figure out something. He'd be like riding his bicycle everywhere. I don't even know if he's in the city anymore. That was y'all y'all glowing and pregnant. So like eating like upscale chicken fingers. They 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 look down oh, on raisin canes. I, I haven't seen that yet. Oh, okay, I sorry. Yet. Spoiler alert. Check out his channel, guys. Uh, Mikey says Atlanta, Illinois. Yes, it's a real place. What? Well, we're sorry. We did not believe what you. What part of Illinois would that? Do you think it's closer to like Chicago, or do you think it's like down south more? <laughs> I don't even know where Chicago is to begin with. I want to say it's, it's Chicago. In the middle. No, it's probably. Top. I'm gonna assume top because it's near the um, lakes. One of the lakes. So it's more lakes. eastern than western. It's, yeah, it's mm -hmm. near the Great Lakes, but then in the uh, Illinois, it's probably like. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, we've never been to Chicago, but we always wanted to go there. Yeah. Wait, Chicago, Georgia? <laughs> Can you imagine if we were like, wait, this isn't the Chicago we wanted to go to? It's fine. And Jackie says it's for real. It's only 1,600 people. Oh, uh, Atlanta. 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 Got Atlanta. it. Thanks for sharing. We're so happy you're here. And Sterling says we had a laser disc player and we bought Mariah Carey's Proctor Theater concert. It was so magical. I love how you, I mean, that's. That's like the best thing you could say. It was so magical. Just describing anything as magical. It's also is already very like, magical to yeah. own a laser disc player. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. everything about that is yeah. magical. Well, there we go. Well, let's uh, let's do another check because the last time I looked, we were at ten minutes. One hundred eighty-three of you are like, "Where is the fa?" I clicked on this video. This like, oh. We're should, closer. should we get our sriracha, like our so dipping sauce ready? For yeah, now? we can do that. Should I do the donut now? I probably should just stick it in the thing for a little bit. Well, I don't even know how long to cook it. So maybe we should do that. I'm now. just going to toast it a little bit. I'll get up first. Okay. Okay. You chill out. You keep the chat entertaining. I'll show the baggie real quick, though. So I don't see that. But Mark picked up these. You can find them in the frozen section. This isn't, I wouldn't consider this super traditional. However, one of the pho restaurants that we go to that does chicken pho, they serve this as a side. And so you can you add it. You could order it to your pho. And I'm like, let's just do that. Let's just make it. Who here has had Chinese donut before? And what other names are they called? Oh, also known as blank or blank. What are the other names for them? I, I don't know other names for them. No, I don't know either. It's okay to put it on the, the sheet, though, right? Yeah. Oh, I thought you were going to use the air fryer, but you're going to use the toaster oven. Yeah, it just doesn't matter. No? I'm worried this might not fit. They're pretty long, but oh, I just yeah. snap it. But isn't that long? Isn't that short, too? Don't want the short man. Who knows that song? I do, and the singer name is Gillette. Sometimes I... 
toss those out there for trivia, but you're like that person in class. Like, I know, I know, I know. Don't want no short, short man. Don't, 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 baby, don't, don't, don't. Don't want no short, short. Oh, oh, this all? is not a short, short man. <laughs> Yes, look oh, at this. Come here, Chinese donut. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna fit. I know that's what he or she said. Oh no, they're not gonna. Oh, I'm worried it didn't hit the top. We have one of those like Japanese, like really fancy toaster oven, but they're not that big inside. I might have to like tear off. Maybe cut off the yeah the one, a quarter of it off on the top. Um, Can I use this? Yeah. Are you still using it? No. Cutting back. I, just, I just need to use it to cut this, but I, it's fine with the Chinese donut. Yeah. My hands might be a little greasy though. I'm used to it. <gasps> well, I'm, I'm sorry. It. Someone is very dry. Yourself. <laughs> Oh, can you turn off the water on the pot if you're there? And then once that gets boiling, I'll add the noodles. But again, we only need to cook this for five to 10 seconds in boiling water. Can you give me a paper towel? Yeah. And you said crank the water? Yeah. Go. I'm cleaning the scissor handle so I don't get any complaints later. We're this down should, to a minute. Maybe we should add the camp back in. This should this well we're gonna do the slow release for a few minutes, but oh, okay, but I think it's just exciting to see the cup down. What do I do? This oh I I did it! Yeah. I'm controller of technology. Oh we got our I think we hit our light goal. People are saying slap the wall to the window. Okay, you wanna do that too? All right, so um, Mandy, oh, yeah. Mandy, do you want to pick a number? The thing went away. What did? I think you took down yeah, the. I have to add it back every time. I'll do that. I'll do that. I'll do that. But do you think this is enough for both of us? This one package. What's the serving size on the package? Four. Four. Should be. Remember, like one time we we're like it's not enough, and then we're, like. I think through? I think we could split half half on this. Okay. Okay. Well, let, let, let's get that down to the countdown, and then we will, uh... Three, is something gonna happen? two, Is it going to make a noise? That's it. And it says nine more until we hit it. Eddie says, I only see 141. Okay, then oh, we're, not, we're not ready. So we're not ready we're good. yet. Okay. okay, we can chill. So, Mandy, we will uh, remember to choose that number once we hit a okay. light hole. Perfect. That. Okay. We'll do that. We're not at... I don't. I can't even see that. One fifty. What is that? We're just not there yet. So we'll wait till we get confirmation. Okay. I might have done the donut early, but I'll just leave it in there, and then it can just hang out. To the window. Mm. Thank you, Tiffany. For my family, one bag can make three bowls. So maybe you can just. I'll just eyeball it. One is enough, but we. One is enough for both of us, but either we just split this half half or make a lot of noodles. Yeah, you know, just do half half. Fine. The mukbang. And Sterling says there's an Asian food group I call on Facebook, and eating the dough is pretty common. I didn't really grow up eating Chinese donut a lot. Um, not until I met James. Yeah. But when we went to San Francisco, Chinatown, there's some restaurants that like at their um, street front window only making Chinese donuts or display Chinese donuts. So for people who just want to snack on something, like James is like he saw it. He's like, remember how happy I was against the window? It's like, oh my gosh, I need to get one. And so we just a, went inside. Took a he... picture with it. <laughs> Because everyone knew I wanted it, yeah. so I was really happy that day. San Francisco. Yeah, that was San Francisco. Ooh. 
All right, do you guys think we can get it 200 tonight? I'm like itching to sing. We have not sang in like a month. The singing game. Yeah, let's do it. I totally want to do that today, but we still have to. The, that's getting done. That's still getting squared away. The noodles is right before. Thank you guys all for being patient. Amy and Bobby says, looks good. Stick around. The food is still coming. And yeah. the singing will come towards the end of the stream. Yeah. We still got to do dessert. Do some? I'm going to just clear the table. Yeah, that. I'll just do my last one. I did my last one, too. This is good. It's holding us over, actually. Yeah. Mm. Okay. go. Mm, did we confirm what the name of the Chinese donut is? I see it over red, the package. Well, someone, Joy says, Yu Tao. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. And Debbie says, I soaked those noodles. Oh, I didn't do it. Oops. We have time. I soaked the noodles right before cooking so it's easy to roll into a noodle ball before I boil it. Mmm. Island making another request, making kanji. If you had a choice, would you want us to make kanji or beef noodle soup? Vietnamese beef noodle soup. Would we even use the pressure cooker to make kanji? I've seen Mark make it without it, and it's just fine. We just yeah, use a rice cooker. Yeah. Are you sharing one or get each get one? Let's just share one. It's fine. Can you show us the inside of the donut? Uh, yeah, once we get it out, I should probably check on it, but I was about it to get up. Turned off already. But I can't get off the strip camera. I'm here. I'm here. And I'm queer. It's perfect, but I, yeah. Maybe right before serving, do like a minute or something. I don't know. I don't even think it needs it. It's already like toasted on the top. Okay. So I don't want to burn it. But I can feel, I can totally see myself just eating one now. I'll eat one right now, because I'm not really going to eat a lot of it. Can I put it on some kind of plate? Yeah, you could use that plate. Um, are you going to sprinkle like sugar or any, or just eat a plain? Straight up. Straight up, don't okay, tell me how to eat in this toast, you like... towel donut. Oh, oh, oh. Gonna eat it in my fogga. <laughs> I'm so good at this. Can't hurry. <laughs> yeah, I'm it's not for... like it's cooking. No, I'm trying to oh. do the other parts of our <laughs> And you're like, I have to leave the camera. So I came back just to save you. And James was singing to Paula Abdul off camera. Well, she still deserves some more note, like, fame. I was just trying to get her. Who, how many people on YouTube are singing Paula right now, guys? How many? Honestly. Oh, it smells really good. It smells good. good. Here, you guys want to look at it? It smells really good, yeah. Now, when you said the inside, I don't know what that means. But I can eat one. <gasps> Kemu! Okay. You know how we said, like, we would never want to see you in person, but we actually do? We could totally take you to get Bumbole. He's never had it. Oh, really? All right, I'm gonna eat one as a tester, okay? So these, I think I accidentally did four without realizing. I mean, it's nice and crunchy. I thought these were each one, but I didn't realize they were connected. They could be one. Okay. Well, I don't know. Michael, you asked for the inside. This is the inside. It's just dope. These are very thin. They're not that thick. Oh, I hear that crunch. Mm. Is it good? Wow. Let me give I, a bite. I'll hold it so you, it's the one thing I don't like it, it is a little greasy. Mmm. To hold it, but otherwise it's fine. Oh, this one's good. This one's good. Yeah. Yeah. I literally it, I put it on the same setting as um, my bagel in the morning. And it was it's perfect. Perfect. Yeah, in Chinese it's you tell. I don't know if I'm saying it right. Can someone correct us? How do you say I'm Vietnamese? Chao wai. Oh, so I have someone to Chinese then. You tao. Chao wai. Now you, now you tell me when I need to switch Let, to let's that. Just, I'm gonna do a quick release right now. Because we Oops. can't wait. In, we can't okay. wait anymore. So we're gonna. I'm gonna move it to this one. It's time for the quick release, guys. 
So this is the. Do you see <laughs> this? Yeah. I hate this part. You're fine, fine, you're fine. It's getting hot in here, hot and so hot in here. Y'all, this is that's what Mondays are for. Release that steam, release all that negative energy. And go forth this week with positive vibes only. It smells so good in here. Can you guys still hear that? It's cray cray, huh? It smells so good, though. It smells like pot, yeah. I, I feel like we're about to open up for the day, and all these people are going to come up for pot. Sean, I might as well. What good will I do if I'm dead and hungry? I got to be full and dead. That'd be better. I am keeping an eye on it. You guys can see me. I'm still looking over there to make sure nothing cray-cray happens. I'm, I got my exit strategy plan if I have to. That's a lot of steam. It's still going, guys. <laughs> I just wait until the thing goes away. It could be a while. So uh, what I'm going to do is then remove all the vegetables and the tea bags and the chicken, strain the broth and make it get even more clear. Mm. Put it back in the pot, keep it on cooking, cook the noodles, and then we'll play. Awesome. And we have... New friends on Twitch. Hello, Eat with Toronto from another food loving duo, duo from Toronto. Thank you so much for joining oh, our and stream. We love our Canadian friends. Yes. Now, I also want to preface for our Twitch viewers you're like, who are they talking to? We're dual streaming right now. So we have a good chunk of people, maybe 173 people on YouTube. And then we have three very special people on Twitch watching us. So if you're ever wondering, like, who the heck are they talking to? That's why. But we love getting oh, viewers yeah. from any any, and everywhere. So thank you so much for joining us. Let us welcome. know where you're, uh, well, you're from Toronto. Mm. What's your favorite food and how did you find us? Yeah. Oh, Amy and Bobby. Using the chummy uh, emote. Oh, which chummy is right there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. I think the Ninja Foodie has had its moment to shine. So we go. Oh, but once this thing goes away, I'm going to open the lid. Yeah, and we'll, we'll, oh, we'll, we'll set we'll it back. Start. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I just want the full effect here. The full effect. With the butterfly. Oh, I want to eat more, but I shouldn't. Eat more. No. Good. Eat the other half. Didn't you cut it in two pieces? Not yet. And Eat with Toronto says, I was browsing under the food and drink page and I saw pho, so I had to click. Well, we're so glad you clicked. Click, 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 click to your toes. Oh, why are there lights? Oh, no, that's the disco lights from the back. I was like, why is the Ninja Foodie doing lights right now? So we're, James wants to eat it with some uh, Chinese donuts. Yes. Not traditional, but something that we saw at a restaurant uh, about a year ago and we're like, we got to do it. David says, fa, fa, fa. Maybe the next time we should do to the fa, to the bowl. <laughs> <laughs> to the fa, to my tummy. Uh, and Amy and Bobby says, Vegas here found you guys on Twitch. Thank you so much, Amy Yay! and Bobby. Yeah. We love Vegas. Love it, love it, love it. Tell us, tell us what we got to do the next time we get to go to Vegas. You tell us. You're we a local. We want to know what, we want to know what's up. And it looks like we're supposed to uh, do the the wall very oh, soon. Nice. Okay. And ASMR fan says I can smell it from here. Oh, Jay. I bet. I you bet. You have to greet her first. Jay. <laughs> Why'd you call her a B? <laughs> what she do to you? <laughs> what did I say? You said Chow Bay. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. B is like um, older sister. 
No, 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 Jay. Jay is older sister. Oh, okay. M is younger sister. You might as well just call her M at this point. Because I, I know an ASMR fan looks like she looks younger than us. We got you more fun. So you guys are wondering what the heck's going on if you just joined. Mark is setting up all the accoutrements for our fa. But our fa today is being made in this contraption. This also looks like a time capsule. We're gonna put things in there. So what's next? I'm gonna strain the broth out. Strain the broth out. Okay, so we have it on the dual cam. So people are gonna be able to see. Once I open the lid. Once you open the lid, yes. Oh, and K. Mu Young has watched ASMR fans Boom Boy video. So, Eddie, if you are gonna get Boom Boy tomorrow, make sure you post it on the Discord. Now, I know we hit our like goal. We're gonna get this situated first. I'm gonna let Mark tell me when we're ready to do that because there's a lot going on right now, guys. There's a lot going on. But that doesn't mean you should stop liking this video because if you get to 175, we might open two panels. Bowman, welcome to the live stream. Vietnamese chicken fuzz sounds awesome. It is awesome. It's so good. And David, great question. I will defer this one to Mark. Is that ninja better than the Instapot? Um, He's coming only, back. He's coming back. Only if you don't have an air fryer, then it's really good because what it actually does is a both air fryer and a, and a pressure cooker in one machine. But if you already have an air fryer, then you don't need a Ninja Foodie. You just get it into the pot. There you go. Boop. That was quick, quick review right there. Okay, it's, I'm going to open the lid. Okay, Mark is opening the lid right now. Thank you for joining all the way from Australia, says Joe. All right, here's the moment of truth. Ooh. Oh, it smells really good. It smells delicious in here. Hi, Lily Beth. Thanks for joining the stream. You guys just joined we haven't eaten yet so you guys still got a whole another hour of this probably so if you guys just joined mark is going to be straining the broth because you want to get rid of the impurities <laughs> is that the right way of describing it once you leave the food description up to me it goes downhill from here i better drink some more so i can believe what i'm even saying All right, we will do that. Just call me Sizzle or Sizzy, Sizzy, Sizzy. And Eat With Toronto says, we're Winnie and Heidi, by the way. Welcome. Yes, again, we got a lot of new friends in the stream, in the chat. Thank you guys so much for joining us. We also got some cheers from Z2298. Thank you so much for the cheers. We appreciate it. Eddie says, I swear I can smell it. OMG, it smells delish. Guys, look at this dual cam action, right? You 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 be, you probably think that we've been doing this for years. We have. We really have. So Mark is taking out looks like the chicken right now. We use chicken drumsticks. This is this is straight up pho broth, chicken pho broth that Mark made. He could have easily gone the shortcut way, which is buying the chicken broth broth. Is that redundant? Chicken stock. <laughs> chicken broth broth is what this is, is literally what I just said. But oh my God. what? I, I just broke a piece of chicken. It'd be very delicate. Break it. Now, ASMR fan says pho facials are the best. That sounds kinky. That sounds like an urban dictionary thing where it's like a Vietnamese man, blank, blank, blank. And you can fill in the blanks, everybody. Oh, that's dirty. Yeah. Uh, does it smell like onion though, Mark? <laughs> it just smells like pho. I don't like, like oh my God, this came did you, oh my God. I missed that because I was looking at you. Did you guys just see? Oh this God. is falling right off the bone. Aren't you grateful for this cook cam? And Mega Mix says, hi, beautifuls. What's up, beautiful? Thanks for joining. James getting ideas, of course, Bear the Barrier. Bear the Barrier, you didn't answer my question on Discord unless I haven't checked. How do we know each other? How do we know? Straight guy says, making your own broth. My BF does that too. Yes. 
<laughs> Put that chicken in the air fryer. You know what? This is perfect. The, the way the chicken has been prepared, Evelyn, will be perfect for our broth or our uh, pho soup. Yeah, you want it soft and yeah. falling off the bone. Speaking of falling, I keep on falling. Oh All right, so Mark is at the sink. Here's the play-by-play, -play, okay? This is pretend this is a Super Bowl. He's at the sink. He's pouring that pot, I believe it's six quarts, into a strainer to get rid of the impurities so that you end up with a clear broth. You want a clear broth for your pho. Now repeat after me. It's pho. That's how I say it. I'm glad, I'm glad James was just randomly clicking for a bit and didn't see what I said. But I but I I, I saw this. What did you say? Am I scrolling up now? Mm, I saw what you said and I can't click on that because not everybody knows what that is. Another piece of chicken fell off. Back to here. Maybe we can move the pot in a moment. We'll show you the chicken. Or am I going to be ramp? Oh, I don't want to be rambunctious. <laughs> There's a lot of chicken, guys. I'm going to add the chicken back in the. Right, oh, then I we're good. Then we're good. Oh my God. Now I need to pour the. <laughs> Is it going back into this? Yeah. Okay, so I got the cam set up. Don't you guys worry. We owe you guys the 150 like goal. Very carefully, Mark is bringing over this. There we go. He's adding it to. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That looks full of flavor. Pause, good care. Now, I, I want you to taste this because this is the part where we need to add more fish oh, sauce okay. or sh sugar or um, salt. Yeah. I don't Maybe sugar. this bowl with a little bit of the orange one. We're going to do a little taste test, okay, guys? Ooh, I like how you just scooped it like that. That looks like we're on PBS now. <laughs> oh, the aromatics are next level. Do you, you should try it. You're no, the try chef. First, okay, try first. first. Okay. We didn't add a lot of fish sauce in the beginnings, we did it a little bit on the bland side so that we could adjust later. I don't think it needs any. It doesn't need anymore. It's hot though. Don't burn your taste buds. That's what I was worried about. <sighs> Chicken soup for the soul. Why do you feed me good food and then expect me to turn it off later? Why? Oh, this it's is so good. good. Like since we're gonna add vegetables and noodles, do you don't you don't think we need a little bit more fish sauce or um, mm. salt maybe? Maybe just a little let bit. Me a little, let me a little, yeah. kiss it a little bit with a little bit more <laughs> sodium. Just a little bit. <laughs> Not a lot, a little what bit. What kind of voice was that? This is the voice of someone that just drank a delicious. This is so good. It's You're so two for good. two, baby. So two for two. He cooked a wonderful meal yesterday. And then this. Okay, just a little splash. That's it. We don't need that. Much. It's like I made a Vietnamese man over here. So while the noodles are cooking, I'm just oh, I forget this is the front side of the uh, I'm gonna just uh so good. Oh, can eat that. Okay. Hi Renee, welcome to the live stream. One of the best thing is pho, I agree. And it was with skin, Island Candies. Okay, I'm gonna cook the noodles. Noodle time. Am I so? Am I allowed to just? Uh, we don't need this cam anymore. I think we good. I think we're done, yeah. Wait. So is it on warm setting or what setting is this on? I, I did it on saute setting. Oh, so that it's still. So it still keeps yeah. The bottom. Look at that broth. You don't see it, but I am using my mouse to circle it. I think for now, I'm just gonna close. The oh, to keep it hot. Stuff. Yeah. I love hot yeah. Wanda Wu, we love our silent viewers. Thanks for dropping by. Diana says, hello friends, happy Monday night. You, you just showed up just in time for the food. 
And K Mu said, Ma Pai Ba. Very good. Yes. One, two, three. What's up, Lubo? Thanks for joining our live stream. If you guys are new and have not yet subscribed, hit that subscribe button, show us some love, and answer these three questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? Yes. We are, if you just joined, Mark is cooking the fresh bun pho, which is the noodles for the pho. We already have our donut here. Mark's already prepped all the vegetables. The broth is done. So we're just building our bowl at this point. We're just going to have a good old time. Brenda, I wish there was a way we could send you some because you are roughing it out in all that snow. And these noodles, yes, were bought at H Mart. Call me Mel, sending us some waving emojis. Hi. Thanks for being here. We really appreciate you all. And you know what? I'm going to, while Mark's getting the set up, there's no reason we can't just do the next window wall thing. So I'm going to call on, call me Mel. If you're still here, choose a number. You're going to see it on screen in a moment. I choose a number, one, two, five, six, or nine. What, wait, weren't we supposed to just pick five? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. So if you stick around, you can choose the next number. We were supposed to pick five, actually, because that was the number that was predetermined previously. So we're going to pick five. Viewer's choice. All right. So this is the way it's going to work. You guys leave your suggestions in the chat, and we're going to just pick from them. Make it reasonable. And that, that's just how it is. You guys choose either a good thing, a bad thing, something you want to happen in the stream, and then we will just choose one, okay? So I'm going to get this set up for... So call me Mel. Remind me. If you're still here, you can choose the next number. If you're not, we're going we're gonna to let the next person go. So far, our first suggestion is mar mouth guard for three minutes. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. A fish sauce so shot. Oh, my gosh. A tablespoon of sriracha. Uh, mouth guard and eat one breadstick. Flash dance. Take a bite of Thai chili and give a huge smooch to see how long you will last. Oh, like, so you can, you eat it and then you have to kiss and you can't let go? We need more clarification. Mouth guard with shot, tablespoon of hot chili oil into your pho. Three minutes of left-handed chopsticks. Fish sauce, fish, I can't say that. That's hard. Say fish sauce shot. <laughs> fish sauce. Right? Yeah, I can't say Because the shot, right? You guys say it at home. Try to say that at home, okay? Hi, Jean. Thanks for joining us. Good morning to you as well. And if you this is your first time on our stream, hit that subscribe button. Answer these three questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? We are about to eat our pho. Mark is preparing that right now. That's why he's off camera. He just boiled the noodles. He's getting everything prepared. So he's working really, really hard over here. Does the noodle look even? I think it's Ooh, almost did that. Yeah. Okay. This one might look a little bit more, but you can't tell. <laughs> Sabotage. I was my skinniest this morning, and now you're giving me more noodles. Okay. Ready for the can? I'm gonna put the broth. Oh, so I need to move back to that camera. Are you guys ready? Let's move the bowl somewhere so we could see it. I will actually I might do the wide angle shot. <laughs> So that the bowl can be shown. Oh, I'll look at that. Oh, okay. okay. A little lower. There you go. Right there is perfect. Now, Joy, here's a spoiler. You guys stick around and you keep liking it. There's already a mouth guard punishment on the wall. So you might as well go with one of the other ones. A lot of other suggestions sound like a lot of sodium. I don't know. 
Tom, welcome. Howdy. Howdy to you, cowboy. Mark is adding the sauce here. <laughs> Allison, I know we've been so horrible about it. Can we discuss the need for James and Mark merch? We're so bad. We got to figure out. We got to get this together. All right, so Mark is adding the umptious, yes, I said umptious, chicken broth to the bowl. It's a little spillage going on you, okay? I can't see that's why. Oh. I can't see anything. Yeah, it's spilling. My bad. Sorry. You're fine. Ooh. Can you get my chopsticks? Yes. How many chicken peels? Two, maybe? I think two would be perfect. <laughs> Joy suggests that we need a siren emoji merch and a chef mark one. Yes. All right, I'm gonna do the wide lens angle because we can't see any of this and I don't want you guys to miss out on any of this right here. Might be a little messy, pardon the mess. I don't know how to play this. Okay. Yeah. Redland says, broth nice and clear. Tell Mark, save me a bowl, Redland says. Okay. Deal or no deal? Okay, Mark is bringing the bowl over. I'm going to change back to this view now. I know it's a little hard to see, but if you want a close-up of this immaculate dinner, join our Discord. That's where you will see this photo that I am going to take right now. We're not done garnishing it. Oh, okay, then I will wait. <laughs> I was going to do one with like all the accoutrements, but I guess it makes more sense for it to be all dressed up. Yes. So, so far, all, all I see uh, in terms of viable suggestions were eat a Thai chili kiss and hold the kiss until we have to let go. And then maybe not a, not a shot of fish sauce, but a spoonful of fish sauce sounds like aggressive. <laughs> so those are the two options that I'm like sifting through because the other ones were related to the mouth guard, but I don't want to pick that one in case we end up getting the mouth guard one. Be aggressive. So I don't know which one you're feeling like, and we probably should do it after we eat or before. During, before, after. During, before. Yeah. Maybe after. Spoon of fish. Yeah, let's do it after because I don't want to ruin like this. I hope you guys understand. So we'll do the 150 like goal thing after and then am i ready for the photo yet yeah oh yeah let's move yours a little bit there can i add like jalapenos and stuff to it? <gasps> yes i forgot about the jalapenos well did you want to add it yourself or no i just it? want you to garnish it so it's pretty okay get this photo ready i don't need the other herbs but everything else will be perfect okay was i supposed to make the sauce this entire time I thought so, but it's okay. <laughs> Austin says, wow, that looks so fucking good. Ooh. I was supposed to say fa more uh, accent -y. Oops. Lady in the Tramp moment. This is hot. I could do the spaghetti, but not this. Not more. Okay. Go take your photo. Kara Jade says, double date. TJ and I will bring the spring rolls. Yes, and we'll bring the rolls. <laughs> 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 All right. Oh, I need the donut in the shot somehow. Can we do that a little bit? Sorry, sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. <gasps> this looks so good, minus the Yeti mic in the way, but that's okay. I got it. I got it. Guys, join our Discord if you want the full-on photo. I know we can't give you guys a close-up because this is hot soup. This is stupid if we try to carry it up here. Ooh, it's hot. Okay. I need chopsticks myself. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Here. Oh, thank you. We got some. Thai. Yeah, what do we got? We got some. This our mint. Mint. Got a little bit of mint, a little bit of Thai basil, and yes, of course, there uh, was ginger. If you didn't catch that part, we encourage you guys to watch the replay. Mark uh, charbroiled some ginger. The Thai basil. Love Thai basil in some, this. This is so good. Some bean sprouts. 
This looks so good. Add some lime juice. Squeeze some lime. And we have plenty for um, another meal tomorrow, right? right? For sure. Yeah. What do you need? What do you need? Towel. There you go. Yeah. There you go. The house must smell so nice right now. Eat with Toronto. Yes. It smells smells divine. It smells like a Vietnamese restaurant. Okay. Leave up there. Can I get a paper towel? Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for being patient. You guys have waited two hours and 15 minutes for our first bite. So we're going to get right into it. Sorry if we miss any of uh, anyone's comments. Just drop it again. We'll see it soon. Yeah, so we don't need to add sriracha and poison. We can add that for the sauce on the Are, side. We, yeah, so we're, we're going to add that. Sauce here and we're going to dip our, I don't know, meat in here? The chicken, yeah. A little bit of sriracha. I don't like to add it to the soup because I already tried the soup and it was good. If good pho, I mean, I get it. Some people like to add it, which is fine. But over the years, I've realized that if I don't need to add it, then that means the soup is like. I used to be the one that added so much sriracha to my pho. But then, yeah, like what James said, for me, then I started to appreciate pho by itself. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I'm just drowning the pho flavor with the sriracha, but I love it as a dipping sauce. Oh, we don't have black pepper. I'm going to grab that. Oh, yeah. I didn't didn't bring it. Everyone's like, they're about to eat. They're about to eat. I'm like, I got to eat this. (gasps) I didn't add the Chinese. uh... (laughs) Oh, thank you. Can you just put the scissors up here? I'll eventually put in the Chinese donut, but I don't need it now. Is it here or no? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Y'all can wait for the first bite. I'm sorry. Okay, okay, okay. Sorry. Mian eh, xin lỗi. No, you're good. Xin lỗi. Okay. Mm, oh, the broth is so clean. Mmm. Mm. Oh, it's good. I'm going to make you make beef fathers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Wow, it's so good. Yeah, this mixture here was green onion, cilantro, and onions. Mm. Now, you don't need to finish the noodle because I actually just used the whole bag for the two of us. But if I do, will you judge? Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. Sorry for the slurping noise. There's no way around it. Yes, um, ASMR fan says, sometimes we make fast pickled red onions and jalapenos with chicken fat. Yeah, we totally do that sometimes too. Well, we have left the brush. <clears throat> onions right there. You want to add the vinegar and poison sauce? I'm okay. okay. Sometimes, so like my, traditionally, you also make a mamgung. Mamgung. Is that I'm saying that right? It's a ginger fish sauce. Yeah. But we're like, James, we thought about it, right but we're like, we'll, yeah, let's just stick with the sriracha and hoisin today. Yeah. But the next time, we'll definitely do the ginger dipping sauce because actually, that's really good. It is good, yeah. With uh, chicken. Don licked my fingers and there's nothing there. Emerita, switch it up. Go go grab a snacky snack. It's okay. I'm loving James's energy. Love it. Thank you, Rush Girl. Mmm. What is the chicken? I'm so tender. Here, I'm going to. Have a piece too. Woo! Mm. Now, if you're feeling like you're getting under the weather, instead of a chicken noodle soup, get some chicken pho. Mm-hmm. Right? This is, yeah. Oh, so good. Mm. Okay, you guys ready for this? This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cut something. Do you want any or are you okay? I'm okay. You're okay? This is basically croutons for your pho. This is what's happening right now. Are you guys okay? Don't come for me. (laughs) Restaurants out here do this. They do. You get a little little donut here, you do a little dippy dip. So it's kind of like eating congee with the Chinese donut. Yes, exactly. Same concept. Yeah. Mmm. Have at least one. Just one. Okay. Wow. Okay. 
Kana, Ka Kana, am I saying your name right? We love you for saying that slurping makes it more yum yum. I agree. Mm. Oh, the donut is so good. Just we should get this brand. But the, yeah. the brand was good too. And that when I remember it. Mm -hmm. mm. Now I know some of you are worried it's gonna get soggy. Mine's sitting on top of like the very top, so it's okay. It has a little layer of soggy, a little bit of crunch. It's fine. It's kind of like when you dip the Oreo in the milk and it's perfect like time duration, then you get that little bit of crunch and a little bit of soft. This, right? Yeah. Mm. It I makes think, me want some ban can, which is the Vietnamese udon, which I never had in my life before. You did? Oh, oh no, no, you you got boom up that day. Remember that restaurant we went to right before it shut down again? That noodle place I took you in Garden Grove. Mm -hmm. They had that there, but yeah, I think you ordered the other dish that you never had, which was that pork meatball one. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm. The drumstick actually works really well on this. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, sometimes when you go to a chicken pho restaurant, like a pho restaurant that specializes in chicken pho, they'll ask you, do you want like with skin or without skin? And then They'll ask you, do you want like the um, all natural chicken or regular chicken? Yeah. Right. And they'll sometimes they'll also ask like if you want all of the chicken. Like mm -hmm. normally they'll give you like the liver, the other, oh, um, what are they called? OFF. What's that word? Offals? Offals? Like the internal organs. There's a word that groups oh, all of those. Yeah. The innards? I don't know. Hmm. Okay, I say we do the spoonful of fish sauce as our punishment then. Okay. A spoonful, do, okay. Do we because the shot is like way too much. That's gonna ruin our everything. But a spoon is reasonable because it's like enough to be like, eh, but not too much where like so when do we do do we do it now? Mm-hmm. Okay. Let me do one more bite of my noodles. You guys are enjoying this video? Hit that like button. Help us get to 200 likes before the stream is over. This is even though it's a lot of work. I can't say it was chill because you did a lot of the work, but it seems pretty chill comparatively. Because it was a put everything into the pot, let it do all the cooking. Normally, Mark is like switching pans, flipping things over, a lot of that. So, we would you say? We barely use the stove top. Dishes wise, I think it's going to be okay too. No? Okay. Where's the fish sauce? Do you have to go get oh, it? Oh, over there, over there. Oh, We're each doing one? Yeah, it's a punishment for both. Yeah. So I don't I actually don't even remember who suggested this, but we're gonna do it. Hmm. That's a lot. <laughs> even Steven. Okay. Oh no. I love fish sauce too. <laughs> this is a lie. This is pretty like almost like how much we add. And for you the guys whole know pie. how concentrated this stuff is, right? Okay, ready? Yeah. Oh beer. Where's the beer? Oh, mm. we're empty. Oh. Cool. It's okay. Chase it with a little lime. It's like tequila. Ooh! Ooh! No, it, get more beer. Hurry. Oh, I have beer. Here, drink some of mine. No, no, no. Uh, flavor wise, it's good, but it just really hits you like boom. You know what? No need to drink coffee in the morning. Just do a shot of that. Woke up parts of my body. Yes. Wow. Oh, my stomach just gargled. <laughs> I don't think I've ever really drank beer while I'm eating pho, though. Only you guys created this. Oh, yeah. What would we normally drink with? 
like oh. soda chan or water. Mmm. <laughs> what parts? Uh, if you want to know, join our Discord. I'll tell you what part after. It woke up everything, okay? It woke up everything. It, it really <laughs> gave a big punch to my body. I had to finish my beer, actually. It was that salty. Yeah. MBB Squad, just um, check out one of our old videos where we ate that. And I think we left a link of a couple places. Though, admittedly, the one place we went to recently wasn't as good as it was in the video. So we do want to warn you of that. But they were asking, Which where can they go locally in OC for Kajang Kajang or whatever. Yeah. So, yeah, just check out one of our other videos. Good night, Brenda. Good night. Wanda says, have you ever invited your neighbors to dinner? Of course. Before COVID. Yeah. We used to love to host. We hosted a lot, yeah. Got a little bit of bones. That's what that was about. Mm. Oh, do you need a discard bowl? I'm doing the, the trash bin is next to me, so it's been easier for me. But Yeah, it's okay. Or the discard pool, maybe? Mm. Ooh, I just got a that star anise flavor back in my throat. I think I might finish my bowl. I thought it was going to be a lot of food, but... It's so good. It's so I'm so good. Y'all making me hungry? That's the point. <coughs> Ooh, something tickled my throat. That Thai chili pepper. I'm gonna mute ourselves. Oh, you're back. Oh my, that was hilarious. <sighs> Lars Yellow Hair says, hi, welcome. Yellow Hair? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Daniel says, any plans for a throwback couch video? Hmm. Yeah, on Discord on fri Friday, <laughs> we fell asleep on our Discord chat. How embarrassing. How long were we asleep on there? I don't know, but long enough for someone to send me a photo to ask if I can breathe under there. Well, there's I a reason the pillow I put on my face. No, I put the pillow over your face <laughs> because I knew you wouldn't like people's because your face your passed out face look with their mouth open and like you know. So I'm like, oh, I better cover your face. Julie, what did we say? She said, I can read lips and hand gestures. We specifically said something to you guys. <laughs> it was a secret message. Mikey says, I thought I hit the mute on my computer. <laughs> and Candace says, this should replace nothing happens. I mean, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, good idea. Could, could happen. Mute ourselves for 30 seconds or so. Yeah. Oh, I don't even know if Mark knows this, but ASMR fan says, do you guys like the fail li liquid? I know sometimes restaurants give you a bowl if you ask for it. Sort of heart attack in a bowl, but a spoon in the broth is so good. So nook bail is like basically fatty broth. And you order that as a side. And like ASMR fan mentioned, you can add it to your soup and it just gives it that extra level of fatty flavor. Like beef pho or chicken pho usually? I think, <clears throat> it, I think it's for both, but I could be mistaken. I think it's, yeah, I don't know. But it just looks like a, a thing of broth with green onions on it. And it's on the side. Let's order it once. And add and we add it to our fall. 
Yeah. Oh, I'm curious. I want to try And the it. word bail means like, so rich, you shouldn't have it. Like, that's how I would define it. I don't think that's what it's called, that's, but that's when I hear- That's similar to Bia. <laughs> no. Oh, like same, it's very similar to the word nukihe. Oh, okay. Like it has yeah. that like, oh, bail. Rich, that yes, right it's the same thing. Mm. Or I am kind of getting full though. Yeah, I'm trying to drink more broth than eat more noodles, but there's just noodles everybody, everywhere. <gasps> Hedy just came out. He's like, I want chicken, fuck. You know, one thing I realized is Vietnamese don't really use a lot of garlic, huh? I mean, some dishes, For some yeah, dishes yeah. but not a Because we didn't use any garlic in our broth in this one. Mm -hmm. Oh shoot, I saw the Serrano as I was eating and I was like, this shouldn't be bad. And I like instantly feel it. It's jalapeno. No, the red part. Thai chili pepper. Oh, then the Thai chili pepper did something. I only added three small slivers. Hmm. You guys need Hadu merch. I agree. I would buy the Hadu merch before any of our other merch. Y'all don't judge me. There's already photos of us deep throating sausages and cucumbers. What Chinese donut gonna do? <laughs> Mm. So good. I am getting full though, but I, I I'm almost done. Yeah. It's so like nice to just eat and not even realize that people are watching us eat. I'm just like living my life and you guys are watching if you choose and all is well. Hedy, what do you want? Everything. He likes chicken. He does like chicken. Uh, we don't buy this often, but when if we do it at Costco once in a while, we get the rotisserie chicken there because it's like five bucks. How can you not, right? Yeah. Um, we may only eat a piece or two and then whatever, but Hedy loves it. He knows the smell. He knows enough to be like, I better go to the kitchen because they're probably going to give me something. Ooh. How do you know? What's he doing? He's trying to he's trying to find some chicken. Mm. Now, growing up, did you eat chicken pho more or beef pho more? I think beef pho is what like my family preferred, so we just normally ate it. So I feel like my pho? mom was like, oh, I, I want to make pho, but I want to do the whole beef thing, so I'll make chicken. So it's still tick marks off, like, I still serve pho, but it's not with beef. Yeah. No, your parents actually go to um, a specialized chicken place. Huh? Mm -hmm. mm. Joy didn't have fun until she was 20. 
You know, my first flow was in high school. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's like me. Like, I didn't have my first soft tofu until 20 something. You didn't have it in high school? Mm -mm. And you live right there? You don't know. Because mm -hmm. I didn't have any Korean friends either at that time. Well, I had one, but he never mentioned going there. So, because my non Korean but Asian friends are like, let's go soft tofu. They love the soft tofu mm -hmm. place in Garden Grove. Austin didn't have fun until he was 23. I feel like we're revisiting the conversation about what was our very first cell phone, what carrier, and what brand of Yeah, cell how phone old were you guys phone? when you had your first bite of phone? What did you think of it, Austin? Because all he said, he, he left us on edge. He was like, I was like, what is this dot, dot, dot? Like, what a cliffhanger. I could see if you never had flow before. It's not like. Mm, be careful with your words. No, like. It's like if you're not used to a lot of that herbal flavor, mm -hmm. okay. then you're like, oh, what is this? Because if you're eating like a lot of ramen or whatever, it doesn't have that herbal flavor. Got it. But it's so addicting after that, you know? Got it. Yes. The herbal thing could be a bit much. Especially your first time, like, I'm like, I don't know what I'm adding to my bus. So I added a lot of the Thai basil in the mint because I see a lot of people doing that. And then I'm like, oh my God, it's so herbally. So you have to adjust the herbal, uh, the herbs uh, to your liking, and then you could increase it from there. <clears throat> I even get the bone. Make sure I got. It. Oh my god! Every time I pick something up, it falls apart. V, we love Bumbawe. We need to learn how to make that because I will. We will tear that ish up if we do that. Done. Um, oh my god, I'm so full. I'm so oh, I don't think I could sit anymore. We still gotta eat dessert. <gasps> <laughs> he forgot, huh? But there's always room for dessert. Oh, okay. That's a good thing. That's okay. you know? Austin says it was a unique flavor at first, marketed on the head. The herbs were a lot to take in. Now it's my favorite food. I call Mama <coughs> Fan like every other week to come make it. Ooh. Do you prefer the beef or the Chicken, and then if you do prefer the beef, what cut of meat do you like? Because oh, with the beef, uh, there's like so the brisket, there's the rare steak, there's the meatballs, there's the bones. I love it all. Oh, oh, Bill might, you know, when it gets tight. No, you okay? Oh, digest, digest, go down, go down, go down. Does like massaging your food down your stomach like does that? It help? doesn't help, I don't think, for me. Clearly, I'm not having the same issues as you. Didn't eat all our noodles. Look, I know we ate <laughs> everything. Oh my, it's so embarrassing. Well, I don't believe in serving sizes. I or if they are, I always believe you need at least two servings. So the serving size they have on the package. Is not what you order at the restaurant. Mm. I feel like this is kind of like maybe what we get at the restaurant for a large size of pot, right? Mm -hmm. You think so? Yeah. I think so. There you go. Clockwise, okay. Mark, it helps with the flow. Like clockwise. Clockwise to you? <laughs> Clock, like, like, yeah, because like I'm not facing my own stomach. Yeah, I don't know. That's confusing. What if he does the opposite way? He's going to come out the other way. <laughs> Jan says, I like rare steak and brisket. Those are good choices. Mm. Oh my God, Joy got the job. Congratulations, Joy. <laughs> Fighting. Laverne. Watch out, Laverne. Joy's coming for you. Uh, how do you say congratulations in Korean? Chukahe. Chukahe. Joy. <laughs> Ajuma. Chukahe joy, please. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to move this. I will move yours too. Ang Samju. Nuk soy, nuk soy. What do you think nuk soy, nuk soy means? You've heard them say that at the restaurant when they bring oh, out. Move food. out, move out. Move out. 
นึกซอยนึกซอยนึกซอย It actually means boiling water, but it just means yeah, like move. Oh, it literally means boiling water, even if they're not holding. Yeah, the water. milk means water, and soy is like boiling or hot, heated. Huh? But even right so, they use that even if they're not even holding hot water. Yeah, so like if it's something like if they're about to turn the corner and they need people to know. The m o i Because it's easier to say that than literally how to tell people to move out of the way. Um. Same with like uh, Vietnamese. When we say we're eating dinner, we say ăn c o n but c o n means rice. But we're not. We don't have to eat rice. But that's just the saying to say you're going to eat dinner. That's kind of like Korean because p a p could mean rice, but it also means a meal. Yeah, yeah. So the same. Yeah. h e a d y s t a r i n g at us in the hallway. How scary of you! Yeah, hey, don't yo. look there. Oh, he's coming. Run! Run! h e d y o h e d y o what are you doing? Oh, he's shaking. He wants some chicken. Set, stay there, h e d y o Set. We're still on the stream. You wait for a little bit, okay? Um, shall I grab what's for dessert then? <laughs> Do you want to get the singing thing going on? Yeah, while the dessert's happening. Are we doing ten songs? Hmm, we could do seven. Uh, give me, give me, give me all your stuff. No, no pad pen. So when J- as James is getting the dessert, uh, we're gonna bring back the word association game. So help me think of seven words. Okay, have to find ten words. Seven's fine. No, James, re- I guess really wants to see. I haven't done it for a month and a half, and now so I'm th- being cut help off. me think of ten words. Um, and James is gonna get our dessert for us. So, if you're newer, um, if you don't know what this is, what we're doing is we're thinking of 10 words, and James has to think of a song that has the lyrics with that word in it. He'll have 15 seconds to think of a song, and he'll sing uh, part of that song with that word. And if he gets seven out of 10 right, then he gets the point. And then if I, if he gets more than three wrong, then I get a point. And we're gonna do Ben and Jerry's for dessert. We also have cookies, but I think we're gonna skip the cookies for now. Good night, it's all. Good night. Okay, keep those words coming. And the hard part about this, though, is um, we've done this for so many weeks that some words we've used before, but I have a hard time like remembering which words we use, you know. And then we're not trying to use like really obscure words, but not too easy words either. Edge says I got gifted a sub by FK Kitchen. Just right now? I don't know. I'm just reading comments. Oh yay! Congrats! Yay! Uh, that might have happened on the last stream, I think. I'm oh, sure. got, I see. Like five of the last stream. Well, thanks to AFK Kitchen. Let's remember to. We don't have too many people on Twitch, but let's try to rate them after this. I forgot what lights I turn off for this. Everything else, but yeah. Besides that. Even this. No, besides that. Oh, besides that, so all of this. Okay, one more word. Keep the keep the uh, words coming. Okay, Mikey, you got the last one. People, Ooh. can you can you scroll up? Hello, hello. Can you do random? Uh, Uh, words. words. Words, so that James doesn't see the chat box. Ooh, if Mikey threw in a word, I think it's gonna be a good one. Oh, I'm full. Alrighty. What say you? I say good. 
So we have cinnamon buns for Mark. Oh yeah. That's his ice cream flavor of choice. And I'm doing cookies and milk and cookies. So we can eat this as we go or, yeah. sorry. All right, are we ready? I'm ready. Are we ready? Okay, number, ready? word number one. You ready? Yes, yes. 15 seconds to think of this word. The word is we juicy. Like I feel like there's a song about someone's butt and they describe it as juicy. Juicy, juicy. Is there a juicy fruit song? Juicy, juicy. Blame it on my juice. Blame it on my juice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. I don't know. Do you know some? I don't think I know, but I didn't think it was that obscure of a word either. It wasn't, but I don't know any songs with juicy. If you guys know, drop in the chat. I don't know any songs with juicy in it. Yeah, the, the Anaconda song doesn't have Juicy in it, or the I Like Big Butts, maybe it doesn't have Juicy? That's what I'm saying. Some, there's a song where they talk about Juicy something. Juicy Fruit. The, like the commercial, Juicy Fruit. I know the Double Mint Gone. How does that song go? Double, oh, double the flavor, double the fun, or... I'm not I'm not singing right, but those are the lyrics. Double the flavor. Double the fun. Doja Cat. See, Doja Cat is too current. I don't know Doja Cat. I know her, but I don't know her. Okay, so you don't get Minus that one, no. Okay, number two, the word is tree. Oh Christmas tree. Oh Christmas tree. Da 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 da. Okay, I'll give you that point, but maybe we should uh, shy away from carol songs because the last few times we did the word association game was all about Christmas carols. I didn't know there were new rules to this revised version. Just say it. I was gonna sing a revise, like another song. I was gonna sing and a partridge in a pear tree, which is also a caroling song. Fine, then let's name a song that doesn't have tree. Yeah. Um, do you guys know a song that has tree? Kosh says cop out. You tell me baby one. Maybe on the treetop. When... So so you going to hate against caroling, but you ain't going to hate against no, nursery. No, I'm not hating caroling, but I'm just saying we're not in that season right now. Okay, okay. I didn't know. It was with but people season. have babies all year long, you know? <laughs> okay, fine. I get that. Lemon tree. Yeah, what other trees are there? Apple tree? I don't know. Okay. Uh, n word number three is wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Huh? Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Huh? I don't know the song, but they just say a bunch of wiggle. <laughs> you apparently need a dance to it. I'm just looking at all the, our history. This oh, yeah. when we did subscriber giveaway and we actually wrote out the numbers. Seven oh two. Hey 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 hey. One four three. Eight two. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Uh, I guess we get that point. Okay. Number four. The word is understand. No point. No. But that's such a common. I'm going to change the rules next what? week. Easy words allowed. No obscure words. Easy words have already been used. So you're okay with that? Like love, mm -hmm. girl, yeah. boy. Because that's not. The point isn't for me to just sit here and say I don't know. I the, the point, point is for me to sing. If that's the case, just sing. No, but it's like more random. I can't. I can't like. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Have you watched. um? What's what the, the idea for this game came from uh L magazine and all their words are like love, he, she, the I know, but but it's they just, only do it once, so it's easier to give them words that have been, been used before because they haven't really played it. But for us, like okay, like I'm looking I just look at yeah, the an list, old one. Let's you know? use the old word. Let's see. They're all gonna be hard because you've already decided they're all gonna be hard. I mean, this is still like 
this is our like fourth notebook. So by then, this is already more obscure word, but fine, sweet. Yeah, that's easy. Yeah. Cool. Let's see. Sweet, sweet fantasy, baby. That's probably what I sang the first time it happened. Happy. Well, Cause I'm happy cop along with uh, na, 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 na. Yeah, get into it. Um uh, hot. Hot summer, a hot, hot summer, hot summer, na 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 na. Pretty. Pretty woman walking down the street, pretty woman. I realize playing this makes me feel like I don't know that many songs, though. <laughs> okay, you can go back to the regularly scheduled program. That's all I'm saying. I forget. Get back. Okay. Uh, number five. Oh, look at the time. Chicken. <laughs> chicken? Is Someone, the, oh, because that's what we ate? We have pho chicken. Chicken pho. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on this farm there was a chicken, E-I-E-I-O, with a cluck cluck here and a cluck cluck there, here cluck, there cluck, everywhere cluck cluck, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. But they didn't use chicken in there, huh? No, they used go to oh, all the animals? farm animals. Okay. Yeah. I was thinking of, um, I feel like chicken tonight, chicken delight. And then, what's that one parody song of Michael Jackson? Amish. Have some more chicken. Have some more fries. It, it doesn't matter. Oh, eat it? it? Yeah. Eat it. Oh. eat it. You know the obscure ones. Oh, chicken noodle soup. Yes. Okay, number six. Hmm. Oh, this one might be hard then. It's okay. I just go with it. But someone suggested it. Hyper. Supersonic and hypertonic. E -da 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 -da. You take me by a do, Mr. Taxi, 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 Did I get that? Is hypertonic one word? Is that even a word? Oh, how, that song reminds me of uh, Ciara. Ciara. Uh, My goodies? No, no. Who's, who sings? Um, you always get Amari confused for everybody. No. <laughs> okay, uh, just confirm me. Hold on. No, oh, you, okay, not oh, not my goodies. Uh, one, two, step. That's the R2. I know. So how does that song go? Hypnotic, supersonic, funky, fresh. This beat is automatic, supersonic, hypnotic, funky, fresh. I was close. I thought that song might have hyper in that. Rock, don't stop. Everybody get on the floor. Put your body up. We about to get it on. Let me see. I want to step. I love it when you want to step. Everybody want to step. We about to get it on. Outrageous. It don't matter to me. Okay. Uh, number seven. Ready? Yeah. Nuna na na. Rasun nu 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 na na na. Da na 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 na. Nu nu na 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 na. Are they up in the air? Ooh na na na. Like this ooh na na na. Hey, did Julie did Julie request this? Yeah. I knew Julie would request. Oh my la, na 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 Put it up in the air, ooh na na na, like this ooh na. I love that song. Just Look it my up. girl. Look it up, Jesse. Rasunun, ooh na na na. It's such this, a good song. Does that word mean something? Is she? She's not saying some. She's not calling someone a nuna, right? I don't think so. Yeah. <laughs> not the way they spell it. Yeah. Nuna, nuna na na. That's a good question. What is that? I don't even know. 
Now you try. What is she even saying? One more know. time. <laughs> oh, very aggressive. Don't touch me. Oh, let's do that as our ending song. Okay. <coughs> oh, you okay? Okay. Uh, number eight, nothing. Because I want it all. Or nothing at all. There's nowhere else to fall when you reach the bottom. It's now or never. Is it all? Or are we just friends? Is this where it ends with a telephone? You leave me here. Nothing at all. Yeah. You don't need him. You don't need him. Because I don't even know what that song's about, but it seems like a female power anthem, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, I keep a bassoon and ana in your ear, so. Okay, number nine, lips. Wait, what's this song? Is that also Lips? The toxic song? With the taste of, With the taste of your lips, lips, I'm on a ride. Your toxic hands slipping under taste of a boy's of poison paradise. I'm addicted to you, but you know that you're toxic. I got love what you do. I try to That should be the wheel. Like something happens. Every time something happens, then we have to do the rasun na thing. That's a good one. We're going to keep that one. How come Julie has not said anything since we sang that song? Well, we she's butchered probably it. probably in the bathroom right now. <laughs> okay. Uh, last word. You're doing really well, actually. If you get oh, this one, you for sure. I mean, you couldn't miss it, and you still win. Then this baby boy here was all complaining in the beginning. Choose the easy baby words. boy. Don't you want my mind? Fulfill my fan. Who's performing at the Super Bowl this year? Our Super Bowl still happening. Yeah. Oh. Is there a performance? Because remember, the week after the last Super Bowl, it was J Lo, Shakira, nonstop. We should host our own. Um, Super Bowl like pre-show. You're you're the headline act. I'm a headline act, and we it's, we can be like Monica Brandy, like we battle each other, but we choose two different rivals, like Christina Brittany. Would you guys watch that? Let us know. Angela versus Ejen Hill. I don't want Mickey Ejen. versus Cardi. Oh yeah, we don't want to go down that route. Oh no, they might fight us. Oh, the weekend. Got it. The weekend. Oh, they're performing. I think it's just what? a he, right? I thought it was a band. Is it? I thought, well, I thought there's it was a just a guy. Singer, there's a main singer, but I thought I thought it was a uh, more than one person. But maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I always thought it was one guy, but I could be wrong too. I'm not even sure. All right, last song. Let's get to the last song. Okay, last song is Sweat. 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 Trigger balls. Sweat. I feel like there's a sex song and it has the word sweat in it. Sweat? Mm-mm, I don't know sweat. I got my sweat down my pants. <laughs> no, the, I, oh, you dip, I dip, you dip. Wait, hold on, what? Notice you, noticing me. No, no, no. Oh no! To the window! To, to the walls! This is a down my balls! Oh, That's the one where you start going like this. <laughs> it's like, yes, right? I feel bad because right when I saw that, Mikey was like, James, you better get this. And it just did not register today. But you know what? At least I helped you get it. Oh yeah, it was a team effort. Was a team effort. One more Rasu Nana before we end this. <laughs> Ready? Our best one. Ready? <laughs> get into the get into the uh, character of Jesse. Okay, Jesse, ready? Eyes. Big boobs. 
five, six, seven, eight. Rasul no no na 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 no no na 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 Oh na na na, like this oh na. This is gonna start trending. I know it. We should start a TikTok where we just do no no na na. Wouldn't you guys watch that? Yeah, we need to eat dessert. Okay, we gotta eat the dessert. Okay, I hope you guys were entertained. I feel like okay, I feel like that month long hiatus. I itch, you know, I itch that scratch, and I'm good now. It's like you're asking all 115 people to scratch your back right now. And you're like, oh, yeah, that's the spot. <laughs> right? Is that what you're saying? Mm. It helped because, like, that was hot soup going down. And now I feel like, oh, this, this, like, this is coming through. Sean says, damn, two Jesse Unis. Unis? Unis. Unis. That's they, the only good song that she has, though, if I think uh, about it. I don't really don't like she? her other songs. Well, I feel like this is her, like, she better come out with something that will keep her popularity high. This might be true. James was enjoying that too much. His ice cream nearly melted. It was kind of soft on top. It's, I kind of like semi-melted ice cream. Yeah. I do. It's good. Yeah. I want to take one more big bite. We'll wrap things up here. Remind me, we're going to raid with the two viewers we have. Oh, if you're on Twitch, join Twitch right now. Stay on Twitch because we're going to do a raid right after when we sign off. So... Mm -hmm. Um, if you're on Twitch right now, stay on. If you have Twitch and you want to switch over, um, we'll give you a minute to do that when James has to wash his hands because I just saw you look at your hands like it's kind of sticky from the ice cream. Can you stop reading your mind? I, girl, I could totally read your mind these days. Well, what do I want to do after this? Go on raid. You cannot read my mind. <laughs> I can read it. That's why I'm not. That's why yeah, I'm not saying stop it. Stop it! Here's, I feel sometimes I feel like you're Al Bundy and I'm Peg. Did you ever watch that show? Yeah, I did. Because what did Peg always like? What was her running joke? Bonbons. You're my bonbon. Joy B is like, what's a raid? You know, it's all good. If you don't know what a raid is, that's it's fine. Um. Are, are we clear on everything? We we did everything that we said we were supposed to do. There we no had other... the fish sauce. We did the singing game. Oh, we didn't get a uh, hundred uh, that subscriber giveaway yet. No, but we do have to do one more wheel spin because we're at a hundred and eighty-two. Oh, we haven't. Oh, we're, oh shoot. Okay, because we, we did five. Right. Wait. Let me double check. One, two, three, four, five. So we do one more. Okay. And Mikey, we're gonna let you choose the number. Uh, I'm gonna remove this because we're done with it. Right. Oh yeah, no more um, Ninja Foodie. Uh, okay, I'm gonna share my screen. I don't know if there's anything good left, really. I hope it, it's a subscriber giveaway. Yeah, so Mikey, you can choose between one, two, six, or nine. Let me just change it to that because I want it to be light up. Next Monday, guys, let's get to 200 before the stream ends, okay? And again, if you're on Twitch, remain on Twitch because um, we're going to do a raid pretty soon and we want to show a lot of love and support to someone that we raid <laughs> at our... <laughs> so Mikey are. chose two and Joy says better be the mouth thing. I will die if it's the mouth. I don't know where the I mouth thing is. I hope it's not the mouth I don't know where thing. the mouth thing is. I hope it's not the mouth thing. <laughs> Wait, they what have to say this? it. They have to say okay. it first. You gotta say it. Say it. We gonna we gotta do it. Oh, but if I get the mouth thing, I'm gonna sing Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no one's saying it, so I think we can just open it. Okay, there oh, we there go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Right. Okay. To the window. To the wall. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so this is okay. So we just have to speak in Korean Vietnamese the last three minutes of our stream. 
So we're going to read your comments, but we're going to have to translate it into our own languages and see how far we get. So let me stop sharing this. We're done with that. Um, how do they say to the window? Oh, bên cửa cửa sổ. Changun uro. Changun uro. Bên cửa sổ. Tới cái trường. Tôi mà hỏi tôi tuốt dưới đây. <laughs> đi đi. To the window. Uh, yeah. Chang Munuro, Chang Muno, Pokaji, Pokaji, Tam, Tam. How do you say balls in Korean? I don't know how to say balls. Vietnamese? I, I, know, I know literal ball, like like a baseball, but Kong, Kong, Tam Kongkaji, Hulon, Kong, 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 Kong is ball. Kongdu, Kongduri. Call me Mel. Translate, I don't care who you are, where you're from, what you did, as long as you love me. As long as you oh, as long as you love me. Mày làm cái gì? Em thương mày. <cười> Còn 2 phút nữa. 2 phút nữa. No, 2 right. phút nữa. Hi, two. 2 phút. Oh, two more minutes. Ừ, đúng rồi. Sao người ta chọn cái này? Tôi không có thích cái này. Có ai Việt Nam trong đây no, không? Nó không có gì xa. Nó không có gì xa. Nó không có gì Naman sarang hai. Ajuma! Chonun wellam. No? Chonun wellam? Wellam, yeah. Chonun wellam. Betinam, wellam, yeah. Betinam. Rasununu na 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 na. Badadadini. Oh, do I have a No, you know. Gong a mop foot, no. Mop foot, no. Roman serrated. Nhớ thích cái video này subscribe gì để comment ở dưới xin chào quý vị trời ơi cú đốp what's the other one comment comment thích cử thích cử trời ơi cú đốp thích cử số nào có cái miếng Chắc số 1 quá. Ừ, vì, ừ. Không có biết nè. Qua bên đây. No. Ủa, hồi nãy làm cái đó rồi. Ủa? Triple punishment. Chủ ghê số? Oh my god. Yeah. Uh oh. <gasps> oh, we gave you guys an extra one. <laughs> Sabotage. <laughs> Wait, no one chose number one though. Did they? No, they chose another number that was triple punishment. Oh, and I just wrote triple punishment twice. We were just looking at the numbers. Okay, we're done with the, you know. Okay. Well, we hope you guys enjoyed the stream. We had a lot of fun. Thank you so much for a delicious plug. Yeah. It was so good. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay, if you guys enjoyed this video, give this video a thumbs up, comment, like, leave a comment even after this video is done. Check out one of our other videos. We'll see you guys Wednesday. We're going to drop a video, 4 o'clock Pacific time. We're eating dim sum in our car, and we'll be back on Friday for another live video. We love you guys. Have a great week, and we'll see you soon. And if you're on Twitch, we're going to raid right we're now. We're going to raid now. I don't know how to do this. Let's see if it works. Bye, guys. How does raid work? I don't know. I want to like make sure this ends before. Oh, wait, I have to click raid now. Like, do people automatically go? I think so. We're still on here. <laughs>